What if it's... Hey, everybody! Oh, no. <laughs> Another episode of Hijinks and Handlebars. Whoa! Yay. What are those? Oh, I can't see it either. <laughs> what are those? <laughs> How even close were you? Not, I, I'm not sure. Really bad. Really I've bad? chosen to, yeah. to practice not wearing my glasses on stream today, and and I've already been able to tell that I it, it's, it's a little detrimental. Oh, gotcha. Yeah. Cool. Great. Uh, well, anyway, so thank you for watching another episode of Hijinks and Handlebars, an actual play kids on bikes tabletop live stream with Q Times. That's it, everyone. Woo! You can go home now. Oh. That's horrifying for some reason. <laughs> <laughs> for some reason, that's very frightening to me. Let um, me try. Let me try. Hold on, let's get wow. into at least first. Wow, Listen, let's, let's play the... When you were gone, that's when we talked about this. <laughs> you look like, we, you no, look like Lois Lane. Now, now you look like Superman. Oh, oh no! Well, you have to spike it to the audience. <laughs> there you go. Wonder Woman? Okay, okay. anyway. Oh, what right. are we doing here? So great. this is the Kids on Bikes tabletop live stream. I just want to get a few things out of the way up front. Um, first, thank you for watching. If you're watching live, I'm not going to be in the chat. None of us will be. But someone will be in the chat with you times, and they will be talking to you. I will read the chat afterwards and see everything that you say. So please say only nice things. Uh, and if you're going to say mean things, uh, also donate money to us. <laughs> uh, say, how, how about yeah. this? Say constructive things. Mm -hmm. And donate money to us. And donate money. And then a couple the other thank yous right away. I want to give a thank you to Hunters Entertainment for uh, publishing Kids on Bikes and for giving me the backpack and these dice that dice. have skulls on them. And uh, and also for being all around lovely and, and kind to us. Uh, another thank you to Acute Times, of course, Indigo and Krug for the production side of things, helping me with that. It and for being the uh, co-founders of Q Times, w wonderful people. Without them, the stream would not exist. And then also. A uh, big thank you to Tanamato. Uh, we miss you. <laughs> Tanamato, who was here last week, yeah. if you caught that. If you missed it, the the video on demand is on Q Times main YouTube channel, oh, yeah. along with the rest of the episodes that we've done so far. You can find them in a playlist called Hijinks and Handlebars, or you can find that playlist at bit.ly slash Handle stream, capital H, capital S. This guy know what's up. <laughs> it's true. I do know what's up. Uh, yeah, so Tanamato did the overlay and some of the banner image for us and some other art. Uh, look that up. You can find that on our, pers uh, our personal Instagrams and Twitters and stuff or on the uh, Hydrox and Handlebar Instagram and Twitter. That's at Handle Stream. Easy for both Instagram and Twitter. Are you crying? I think I just love Chris so much. No, I, I don't know if it's my glasses or it's, it's some sort of allergy. My eyes are just going, so I'm okay. Oh, no. we'll just can't, okay. bear with me. But look at those baby blues, everybody. Look at those baby blues. I'm really, I'm, it's, so not, it's not crying, crying. It's only my eyes that are crying. Jonas is just sorry. so I, excited for this episode. My glasses back. It's, if that's the problem, I should fix it. Sure. <laughs> um. Yeah, but look up... Chris on uh, Instagram and Twitter and on YouTube. He does animation and uh, music and stuff. He's really great. That's uh, at Tanimato, T-A-N-I-N-A-Y-T-O. So, I am William, they, them, and I am the GM for Hijinks and Handlebars. And I am Jonas Newhouse, he, him, and I play Derry Nazari, 13 years old and also he, him. <laughs> Uh, I'm Sam Richardson, and I play Teddy Tedward Tank Thompson. Uh, both of us are he, him. Teddy is 13, and uh, he's, he's, he's less of a good guy, I think. Now we've sort of come to the point where he's not quite such a good kid. I, eventually, I'm going to want a supercut of every time you extend your intro. <laughs> Because everyone else is like, this I just is who like, I am. I just like lingering on this top part up here. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm sorry, Franny. It's your turn. And I've you been taking what? your it's time. Fine. And I feel, you know what? I just want to say I feel really bad about it. Do you? And I just want to take this moment. Really? You're taking more really... time to apologize. <laughs> and just wow. one realize wow. this really, really got to say. And then I just break it down to I'm Franny, I'm Gertie Fox, and I'm 14. What are your pronouns? Consummate. Uh, she, Professional. her, she, her. Oof. Spencer the Bell, Frankie Fox, he, him, he, him, let's go. Yeah, and by the way, if you have any problem with like anybody like saying their pronouns at the top of anything, uh, leave my stream, you garbage person. <laughs> I don't care about we, you. We uh, <laughs> want everyone here except for people who think that. Yeah. Uh, anyway, so. There may be other things, actually, but. Hijinks and Handlebars is, is a bunch of kids, a group of kids that are in 
uh, the town of Bald, a very small town, and they found a very small dog, and they figured out that it has very big magic. And uh, they are involved in uh, magical dogs and also a place that is mysterious and scary and suspicious and peaceful at times and called the Shadow Place. It is, it is shadowy. Or the Nightmare Zone. Or, uh, <laughs> or the, the Dark other one? Area. Wait, what was the third one? The Dark Area, yeah. The dark, oh, it was Dark yeah. Area and then Nightmare Zone Nightmare was the last Zone. one. Yeah, that's right. NMZ. So, NG. The DMZ. last the time... NMZ. <laughs> Last time on N- NMZ, they <laughs> would do it. It's a metaphor for the. Are you? Why are you doing instead of? N- it would just be NZ, right? Because well, it's, you're doing N N Z. It's it's not, it a, it's not a horse TNZ. after dusk. I'm just thinking oh, DMZ. Never mind. I actually much prefer horse after dusk. Have horse after dusk as a nightmare. Dusk. This all just been a metaphor for. Never mind. <laughs> a horse with no name. <laughs> it's not walk worth. Through. Anyways, recap. So Wait, last time on hijinks and handlebars. Um, yeah, where'd we start? Um, spe- are we talking 12? Or okay, 12 actually, I'll talking... say not 12.5. I'm ta- talking 12. Not, I'm talking 12. Yeah. I'm talking 12. Mm-hmm. Which was the last one. Which, Which was the last, last linear episode. Linear one, last yes. linear episode. So basically, um, we were, we opened on Teddy going home to his parents and uh, having a discussion with them about what they would do to bring Andalyn back, and they were like, oh, we would do anything, but hypothetically, and this is kind of like not great ways of thinking. Teddy's like, peace, okay, great. Uh, Reads a letter that he's been saving from Andalyn, uh, and then hops out the window and goes towards the graveyard in town. It passes by the family clinic where the foxes are, and uh, Frankie is the only one who is not asleep, sees Teddy walking outside the window, goes to uh, chat with Teddy, see what is up. Teddy is like very uh, defensive and is like, I want just go back to go back home. I, I need to go do this thing on my own. And uh, eventually Teddy does go off to do this on his own. But Gertie, having explained everything to Phoebe Fox, uh, both of uh, Gertie and Frankie's uh, mother, she realizes probably where Teddy is going and follows him. Derry went home mm-hmm. yeah. and uh, and received a phone call from Taryn Takahashi. Uh, uh, Derry's grandfather, Baba Vahid, uh, answered it, and then they both went on a mission to bail Taryn out of jail. <laughs> So they called Nicole, the the bus driver in town, and um, basically and just or, ordered transit. Which is, I'm still so surprised it's a thing. that's a real it's thing very you much can a thing. do. Yeah. I did not know It's this. a thing we could do in college. So. When there's a bus and no Uber, what are you going to do? Let's walk. When there's a bus and no Uber, Teddy's dad is a YouTuber. Hey. So we did bail, bail Karen <laughs> out after, after a whole thing. Yeah. Um... <laughs> And uh, Teddy ended up going to the graveyard, entered the graveyard after something mysterious happened with the lock, uh, oh, no. started uh, tracking down Andalyn's tombstone and was getting ready to dig up, then was found by Phoebe Fox. And Phoebe had a moment where she just laid everything out for Teddy and said, you know what, if this is what you need and you believe that doing any sort of thing might bring Andalyn back, then I want to help you with that. So they began digging to, to dig up Andalyn's body and so they could uh, take it and bring it to the woods and bury it so possibly Andalyn could come back to life. Meanwhile, the foxes were just concerned about exactly what was going on and uh, Gertie and Frankie were concerned about their dad who had just woken up, Marcus, and they pretty much were just deciding where they go from here, how things have been. Uh, Gertie told Marcus everything that had happened up till then, which was then the first time Frankie had heard about officially the dead bodies and the burial like grounds and everything. Uh, so they processed that. Derry made it to the sheriff's office, uh, encountered Bing, who didn't know how to bail somebody out of out of jail because it never happens in town. So they they big one it. <laughs> Uh, which is Bald's version of Google. Bing, big one, the bail. Bing, big one, the bail. <laughs> and they got Taryn out of uh, out of jail, and Derry and Taryn had an exchange that pretty much ended with a. This is very confusing, and I don't, I don't know how to feel about this goodbye. Like Taryn mm-hmm. was like, "Okay, I'm gonna leave now," and Taryn was confused. Derry was awkward. 
Uh, uh, Vahid was Vahid was charming. Eating cookies still, he maybe. Was there were no cookies. They they were all given to Nicole. They were all That's given right. to Nicole. Nicole. Yeah, the bus driver. But then you wanted to collect a, a cool rock to give to Cole on the on, for the drive back. I just watched the episode today, <laughs> so I remember everything. Um, and, but then uh, Teddy kept digging and kept digging. Phoebe got a phone call from from Gertie um, and and Marcus. Well, from Marcus, uh, wanting to know where she was, how Teddy was, what was going on. Uh, Phoebe had to cover for Teddy because. They didn't want anybody to know exactly what was happening, so then Phoebe had to leave in order to like keep that sort of charade going. But uh, upon leaving, Phoebe was like, "I'm going to tell. I'm going to tell them. I don't. I'm not going to keep this from them." And Teddy just said, "Like, give me four hours." So Phoebe went back to the family. Teddy continued digging and continued digging and continued digging. Uh, when Phoebe got back, the foxes had kind of like a blowout, like a fight, and uh, there was a lot of. Why don't people trust each other? Why are all these secrets being kept? Why can't you tell us where Teddy is? Why can't you tell us what you were doing? And eventually that led to Gertie picking up Bibi and leaving the family clinic. And uh, Phoebe went after her and she ended up just walking completely across town all the way back to their home. Um, and then when she was there, she wanted to go to the shadow place so she asked Bibi to bring her to the shadow place. Uh, upon which Phoebe, uh, Phoebe no, um, Bibi <laughs> teleported Gertie back to the graveyard, where she heard Teddy desperately, sort of like calling for Andalyn and not understanding why he couldn't find uh, a coffin or her body even though he dug down like 10 whole feet into the ground where her grave plot was uh gertie didn't know how to handle that and didn't want teddy to know that she was there so she left and started heading back home again and was trying to figure out how to get back into the shadow place but bb was too tired from using her powers and was asleep and then she heard declan call down from his treehouse and invited her up to have a Halloween scary movie marathon the night before Halloween up in, in the treehouse with him. And he made hot cocoa and he had hot water for BB. But by the time they had gotten that together, uh, Gertie and BB had already fallen asleep in the treehouse. So Declan, you know, just was chilling and was like, okay. <laughs> Gary ended up getting back home with Baba Vahid and went to sleep, but then was woken up by another phone call <clears throat> from Taryn Takahashi, who just wanted someone to talk to that understood because it was a very uncomfortable and, and strange situation. Scary, maybe. Yeah. <laughs> Not that Taryn would ever um, say so. Well, uh, and, I, uh, and finally, where we left off, Teddy was still in the hole in the graveyard, got his shovel stuck in the side, and then heard footsteps and another flashlight. And it was uh, Sheriff Sandra who asked what he was doing. And he very plainly said, I'm trying to dig up my sister's body so I can bring her to the woods and bury her so she comes back to life. Something, I all, like almost verbatim that. There was a, a beat and then said, but her body isn't here. And then Sandra said, I think I can help you with that or something. I think I, I, think would... I know a thing or two about that. Yeah. I think I, I... Which, which we all agree was clearly like uh, foreshadowing malice, right? Definitely. She was going to start burying Teddy in the yeah. hole again. Yeah. I think I yeah. can help with that. Mm -hmm. Kicks in dirt. <laughs> so Sandra helps you out of the hole and is quiet the whole time. Does, doesn't want to address exactly um, what was going on and gets you in the squad car, takes you back to your parents' place. The the second episode in a row where we're starting with you being brought to your parents or you, or you showing up to, trouble, to Michael and James. Trouble. And um, And Sandra goes up to the front door and you can open it because it's your place. 
uh, and brings you inside, and your your dads are both asleep. So, um, Sander would tell you to like go wake them up yourself because hearing a police officer in your home saying, "Hey, get up," yeah, probably not great. Probably not great. Yeah. Um. So you collect your fathers, and you and your father and your other father and Sandra are all sitting down in your living room. And Sandra is the, has decidedly been like, man, I'm going to be here for this. And she gives you the opportunity to explain where you were and what you were just doing. Uh, I think I think Teddy is really tired at this point. Because, I mean, to be fair, it has he did spend the whole last, like, 12, 10 hours, something like that, like digging. Uh, like I think it took him. No. It took him at yeah, really? yeah, yeah, yeah. Because he left that previous night. By the time he got to the cemetery, it wasn't that late. And then he dug until the next morning. Sandra found him like basically at dawn, right? That was um, what we established. It was like it was kind of late. Yeah, it was. Either I mean, here's the thing: four hours of straight digging, digging, and also like lot. with the energy you were bringing into it, yeah. that's a lot. Yeah, yeah. It was like it was. I, yeah, it was a lot of digging. I think like. Like emotionally, like yeah. just drained as well, though. Um, and I think he, I think he lays out exactly the story he told Sandra. I think he says, "Yeah, I was, um, I was trying to find Andy's body so I could take it to the woods and bury it, so that she could come back to life." And then he's just fiddling with his thumbs. So. Both of your dads are kind of stunned, and Sandra just looks at them as like, like, come on. And um, so Michael starts and, and just cool. says, oh, um, I don't know. <laughs> Well, I don't know exactly why you think burying Andalyn in the woods would would do anything like that. Um, I I'm sorry. I, I Teddy. I don't know. I don't know what's. I don't know what to say. I don't know. And and Sandra will will, will cut in and just be like, okay, so. I don't really understand the digging up the body and burying it thing either. Um, you know, kids get a lot of ideas in their heads, and I, I get that. So, um, uh, but this is pretty excessive, Teddy. And, and honestly, like, I don't want to have to go through with anything. I mean, you're trespassing. You're out past curfew again. I've I found you. Was it yesterday? Oh man, time is moving pretty slow. <laughs> but the reason I brought you here is so that your fathers can explain about Andolin. And uh, James kicks in and is like, oh yeah, okay. So um, after we had the, the, the wake and everything where, I mean, like you saw, uh, her there. Um, we, your father and I, got, I don't know, just a sense of uh, uncomfortability or, or something. So after we had all of the ceremonies and services and everything, we, we just decided it would be best to um, have Andalyn cremated. So we still had the the grief plot and everything, um, and we had the stone, so we thought it wasn't super important why to... Didn't, why didn't you tell me? Well, you know, I don't know. That's a good question. <laughs> I really don't know. We could have told you. Um, yeah. I thought maybe 
it would have been weird for you to hear that your sister was cremated? I don't know. Is that weird? Does that feel weird? I don't know, Dad. Yeah. And Sandra will get up and um, just, like, you wave a little goodbye to everyone. And she's going to look at you, Teddy, and be like, Hey, um, don't worry about any severe punishments or anything, but I do need you to go fill that hole back in. Okay. All right. Be careful. While you're out there, there is a bear in Bald. There's... So. And we still haven't found it. So just keep that in mind. Right. Okay. All right. Be safe, everyone. And then Sandra leaves. And it is like, it's super awkward quiet. And then Michael chimes in. So. (laughs) So you. Whoa. Oh, man. And that's like him laughing. He's like, he's like laughing. Wow. Oh, you. How far did you dig? Over my head. I think I hit like bedrock or something. Oh. Um Wow, wow, hey. Um my goodness. I are you, I mean what do you do you need do you want uh, we can He's, get, Teddy's like covered in mud. Uh, like yeah. still like covered can, um, completely covered in we mud. We can uh start bringing you do you need to I don't know. Oh god. Um like therapy or something i mean we can start bringing you in we can um you know james can pick up some more hours uh down at city hall and and we can we can afford honestly dad i just need you both around more yeah yeah I think we've been pretty selfish. Because it's been really hard. But, I mean, of course, it's also been super hard for you. So, um, I don't know. I think I've been... uh, kidding myself because, you know, as long as I'm friendly and and nice and uh you know i say hi to you and bye and stuff like that i don't know but i mean also okay we we will be around more but also you you have to be around more because you go to the fox's place all the time and you go to to dairies for the practice um and you know what if you if you want to go to dairies for practice i want to i want to go with I want to hear your band. I mean, the, the songs aren't done. We're not done. We're not ready to play yet. I, that's, hey, if, if anyone knows anything about the creative process, it's me, you know? That's true. Because yeah. I, I mean, like, sometimes I'm editing in a video for, like, five hours or something. Yeah. It's the same five seconds I hear. It's just over and over again. Yeah. <laughs> and I, have you ever yeah. heard your own voice over and over again? It's, yeah. S- saying... Oh, well, see, you just have to take the Phillips head and, you know, like, oh, how many times can you say Phillips head and, like... Derry, Derry has this really loud sound system. Sometimes he lets me sing, and it's it's, it's a lot. Yeah. Honestly, I don't think I should be a singer. I think you got a perfect voice for singing some punk rock. That's and then <laughs> James, James laughs, like, off to the side... And just goes like, you basically just told him he has a bad voice. <laughs> <laughs> and like they both sincerely I, laugh. Yeah, like, I think Teddy does too. I think that that is like a, I think that's the scene. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. Um, 
for sure. Like I, I think they they dig a little bit more into you know exactly what maybe led you to go this far with it. But I, I think they're more understanding than anything that like they didn't handle this. There hasn't been a lot of communication. So, um, but yeah. I Teddy, think. Teddy tells them as much as he can without saying anything about bb or magic powers or a monster running around in the woods or going to the shadow place or the or dead kids in the woods the dead kids in the woods or, or how the woods can fighting bring back the fighting dead. with Terran. actually he probably does mention fighting with Terran, but he doesn't mention why they needed the photo why that they stole a photograph from Terran's. i mean there's like there's some stuff that <laughs> I, get it, I get it i get it okay <laughs> there's um, a lot of dancing uh, <laughs> were you expecting to say so many and no or, or is, i just kept thinking about it there um, I will say this is the lightest your home has felt since the accident. Like, I think this is the first time you heard, like, because James, James laughs all the time still. And, like, you can kind of tell, like, sometimes it's like a forced laugh yeah. or, like, oh, I'm laughing because when I laugh, I know I can make you kids laugh, like that kind of thing. But you haven't really heard Michael laugh since. And I mean, he he started the conversation with you by laughing because of mm -hmm. how uncomfortable it was. And yeah, so that's how that goes. Um, Derry, just to touch in, I'm pretty sure Taryn falls asleep on the phone. I was going to say that I think Derry did too. I yeah. think there's like a hanging phone over the back of the couch that Derry's like almost holding. So... Yeah, and Baba Vahid will come over at some point and, like, put your arm back onto you and pull a blanket over you and make sure you have, like, a cushiony pillow. I fucking love Baba and, Vahid. And, then, and he's going to take a little cupcake out of his out of a, out of a jacket pocket. <laughs> and just, like, hag <laughs> it's, it's a little bit squished. Yeah, and place it on the on the arm of the of, of the couch that you're, you're sleeping on. Hold on. What if it falls asleep during the night, though? <laughs> Uh, uh, what if it falls off? <laughs> what if it falls asleep during the night? <laughs> what if the cupcake falls asleep during the night? I have night? a better suggestion. What if this happened so many times? What if this happened so many times that with an eight grit, a little bit of dairy wakes up just to eat it while the rest of him stays asleep? <laughs> Great. <laughs> Yeah, I'm fine with that. Cool. <laughs> Thank you for these new dice, William. They're perfect. <laughs> yeah, you're welcome. <laughs> they let me eat cupcakes in my dreams. Uh, <laughs> and then, um, uh, and then, uh, Vahid will take the, the phone and, um, Hello. listen, listen for a moment and doesn't hear a dial tone, just, like, kind of hears, like, some snoring, so, like, some soft, like, breathing or... And, yeah, and very, 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 very low, chainsaw. very low thrash metal, like low volume. I used to do <laughs> she it. Falls asleep to throw. I used to fall asleep because cool, it's it's That's so true. much sound. At, it's like so if much you sound. if you like get used to it, it's yeah. like it's like melodic white noise. Where where it can be. So I would do that. Yeah. Okay. Good. Sure. Sure. I'm mean, yeah. Go here's, here's she seems like the type. He's very soft to like thrash metal. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Baba, Baba Vahid pulls out his iPhone and, like, like shazams the song. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I'm adding that to my picture. <laughs> I'm so glad he knows how to use apps at fucking, like, 92. Um, Frankie, yeah, you sleep just, like, up on your on your father's chest, and um, the two of you are just, like, in a hospital bed uh, at the family clinic for the rest of the night. Um Gertie, you're asleep up in Declan's treehouse. And Phoebe is back at the Fox's uh, home, if we didn't completely determine that. <sighs> so, she still thinks I'm there. Yeah, she, she doesn't also, know you left. She also still thinks Teddy is in the graveyard and or the woods. Maybe. Something. Something. Mm -hmm. Somewhere. So... You wake up, and it's Halloween. <laughs> it took us so oh, fucking long to get God. here. Oh, my God. It took, you know, you know how long shit. it took? We got to Halloween on episode 13. <laughs> yeah, we did. We talked oh, about I this. I didn't even plan yeah. that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We were like, let's not tell William and drop it on, on yeah, the stream. Hey, are, are you, I, I, I was hoping you would be destroyed. Yeah, no, that's great. No, we be destroyed <laughs> oh. for a minute. No! Ah! Yeah, the players win. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you. Okay. Great. Um, so, yeah, isn't that cool? Isn't that awesome? Yeah. That is awesome. Yeah. 
Um, we spent a whole arc in the three days leading up to Okay. <laughs> One time I asked my dad, how is it? This was in high school. I was like a sophomore. I said, wouldn't it be weird? No, I was a freshman. Wouldn't it be weird if Halloween happened on Friday the 13th? And my dad was like, yeah, because it always happens on the 31st. <laughs> That's also a bit, like, straight out of one of, like, the oh, screen or one of the scary movies, too. Jesus. How like, much of this is going to be me saying stupid things I did in high school? Let's leave the trash metal. All really of stupid. it. Keep going. But, Wouldn't it be weird? Wouldn't going. it be weird? Yes. It would be very weird. It would be weird. very weird. In fact, impossible. Or the calendars have changed. Um, Let's lobby Congress. <laughs> uh, the first thing Derry needs to do is get some water because he ate a cupcake in the middle of the night. <laughs> I still imagine yourself like blue frosting. Oh, yeah. 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 It's, it's about the color of these wonderful dice. That That's what I was thinking. Yeah. I actually, yeah. You know, purple and teal. That was teal. the frosting. There's a little, yeah. little unicorn cupcake. Yeah, so you, you go and get some water or mm-hmm. some soy milk or something, you know? Oh, yeah. I, I feel like it's water first. Just kind of walk that down, but... <laughs> Um, <laughs> yeah, just water first. Please. first you know. he's, he's got two two cups, one with water and one with soy milk. Yeah. He's taking just drinks. You need, out of you one need to wash the down the, the cupcake, but then you don't have a flavor in your mouth, so now no, you can drink the soy milk, milk for yeah. the soy milk flavor. Yeah. Right? The cupcake and soy milk doesn't work great no. for dairy, but if he clears it out. Yeah. It's like can... it's like the ginger you get with sushi. You're mm-hmm. supposed to eat between the rolls. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Uh, yeah. yeah. So. I didn't know that. <laughs> I just always use the ginger. I just ate it with my mouth. Like, I just ate it. <laughs> It's a palate cleanser. That's what it's, that that's, makes that's so purpose. much sense, dude. Oh, interesting. Yeah. Huh. Yeah. Wow. So, I just really like ginger, so I just like shave it yeah, off and like I, I eat the whole thing. Um, Frankie, yeah, I want. I so you and Marcus both wake up, like like in a day that. Uh, what what time is it? What, oh, what year is it? Wait, hold on. Um, and Marcus picks up the phone and looks at it and sees that it's like it's like seven a.m. And he goes, "Oh no, you're gonna be late for school." <gasps> Wait, hold on. Dad, dad. And what's I'm just that? like, do the point. Wait, oh, wait, what's this? I'm getting a phone call. Hello? Yeah, sorry. It's Professor Fox. <laughs> um, I don't feel well. I can't make it to school today. <laughs> oh, you don't say. That's too bad. Well, feel better soon. <laughs> Oh, thank you so much. You sound real hot. <laughs> oh, yeah, thank you. You're all so sexy yourself, sir. Bye bye. Don't tell your mom I said that. <laughs> To, to another person. Yeah, your professor, Dr. Fox, called in, can't do school today. Oh, no. I hope they're feeling all right. What do you want to do? Back around and paint things? What'd you just say? <laughs> what? Well, let's well, back around. Get oh, some back spray. around. I thought you said fuck around and, <laughs> fuck fuck around around. and paint some stuff. <laughs> oh, <laughs> yeah. Funny. We can just yeah. get like some spray paint and then just like find some like uh, 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 fire stations. Not fire stations. The little the little things that Hydrange. the water comes out. Hydrants. 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 Fire. Hey, you're saying hyd- hydrench. Hyd- hydrench. 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 Fire hydrants. Let's find some hydr- fire hydrants. Let's hire some fires. Let's hire some fires and just like, I don't know, get artsy or spooky. It's the good day for it. Artsy and spooky. They don't need to be mutually exclusive. But let me tell I'm sorry, I just woke up. Let me tell you. <laughs> You can't start. You can't start your day without a good breakfast. We and, should get. And some... he goes and pushes the button. <laughs> no, it's taped over. It doesn't matter. He pushes really hard. <laughs> I know it's taped over. He pushes really hard. And because it's taped over, now it's stuck. So it's going. <laughs> I had that so many times last night. It was great. Gertie, you wake up. And like, baby's in your arms, and you also have a, a a blanket, and you're on a sleeping bag. But the sleeping bag's like really like high end sleeping bag, so it kind of feels like a soft mattress. It is a very gentle uh, vibration. It's it's like a <laughs> massage mattress. Yeah, and there's some like very soft classical music playing, and you you wake up it's to the, <laughs> you wake up to the seasons. smell of like bacon and eggs. <laughs> <laughs> Did you start laughing? I don't know. <laughs> Declan uh, pokes around the corner, like uh, through a doorway. Oh, <laughs> no, but oh, uh, rise and shine. Wait, uh, so I, uh, wake up. Wa- at a bu- Sorry, I'm getting my idioms all screwed up. Um, wait a minute. Well, good morning. 
I'm making I'm making breakfast. You eat meat, right? Do you eat meat? <laughs> oh, no, really, no. You're in the scene. You can't. We're allowed to break. We're allowed to break because we're off camera. <laughs> Declan has a really nice kitchen. Don't laugh at him. In his treehouse. Wait, put my glasses on and you'll stop crying. It worked for me at the beginning of the scene. <laughs> We're gonna get through an hour oh, of content. No zero content. <laughs> no, today. Twenty minutes. I think it worked. Um. <laughs> you, you look like Lois Lane. Um. She. Went, well, first of all, she doesn't want to get out of this sleeping bag because <laughs> it's so warm. Yeah. And yeah. It's so comfy. She's like, wait, do you do this every morning? I mean, no. I usually just make myself a pop tart. <laughs> I love Declan. Is it the one with these colors on it? Yeah, it's yeah. wild berry. Yes, yeah, that's the one. If you want me to toss out the bacon and the eggs, I could just make some wild berry pop tarts. Why not both? <laughs> <laughs> what did he look at? I gotta know. Declan looked. Uh, turned and looked at the eggs and bacon, <laughs> and then and then like looked just past them, and there was a box of wild berry pop tarts. <laughs> Um, that's genius. And uh, it'll be nearly like walk out and then poke back is like, wait, do you want some orange juice while you wait or something? Yeah. <laughs> 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 oh, look behind you. And then he goes back into the kitchen. There's a glass of orange juice sitting behind you. <laughs> oh my god. But what if what if it, it what if it had fallen asleep in the middle of the night? <laughs> It had like one of those. Gertie's so used with to it. She drinks. She it. just drinks orange. Were you doing a commercial just now, by the way? <laughs> Were you turning with the orange juice? Up? <laughs> orange juice is behind me. Yeah. Um, orange juice. But it's, it's half. Me. It's half drunk because she was drinking it throughout the middle. Ah uh, yes. Do you yeah. roll a grit? <laughs> really? It's vodka. It's a mimosa, actually. No. <laughs> no. no. It's a mimosa in the in the sense of when you drink all of your orange juice, you have mimosa. Mamor, sir. Mamor, sir. Mamor, sir. I have Mamor. I don't get it. Explain it to me. No. Um, <laughs> uh, but actually, legitimately, she's not going to get out of the sleeping bag just yet. That makes sense. Uh, so she's just it's sipping on her OJ with BB in this fancy sleeping bag, listening to classical music and filling her nostrils with no the more. smell of uh, <laughs> <a> bacon. Stop. <laughs> not both of you. <laughs> Unless you do in perfect harmony. <laughs> Okay, so Declan will finish making breakfast, which is, uh, which is four slices of bacon each, two eggs, uh, uh, two eggs over easy, and then uh, two poached. I like mine poached. Oh well, then Declan, Declan didn't know that. Declan's are over easy, and then he goes back and makes poached eggs for you. Um, but <laughs> and then also wild berry pop tarts, and orange juice. It's just wonderful. And, and then a single what, what, garnish of parsley. A single garnish of parsley, and uh, and when he brings it out, like sit down, like you're both eating, and you're, you're sitting crisscross applesauce on the ground. No, well, I'm still in my sleep. Well, yeah, so you you have it like you look like a, a, a cocoon. Yeah, it's, I'm like sitting up, and it's like overhead. <laughs> <laughs> and and Declan is eating, and and then it's like, uh, so this probably goes without saying, but if you could, uh, will you leave this morning? <laughs> Could you just like be real stealthy about it, and then I'll also and then worry. also don't? Uh, but I also play D and D. I have a GM. Do you want to? Oh, we'll get. Oh, never mind. Um, d- so, uh, but can, just don't tell anybody you slept up here, especially not my parents and not your parents, because your parents will tell my parents because parents tell each other everything. I know. My parents don't even know that I'm here. What? Your parents don't know you're here? Mm-mm. You were here just without anybody knowing? Mm-hmm. Huh. <laughs> and you're not going to get in, like, super trouble for that? I probably am. Oh, okay. All right. But for a second worry, there, I thought I, I was living in a, a dictatorship. <laughs> uh, but we're fine. Everything's okay. I uh, won't tell them where I was last night, so you don't have to get in trouble. You don't have to cool, explain cool, to your parents. Cool, cool, Yeah. When you see Declan, tell him not to count out that it might still be a dictatorship. I'm not sure this rules it out. <laughs> okay. So, Teddy, how's your morning? 
Uh, tired, tired as hell? Yeah, this is a good question. So did so Teddy didn't get the chance to sleep. Not really. Actually, we, we cut to your your house and I think your dad's and you are still like asleep. No, I think I think you're still awake. Okay. All right. I think you talked all night. Okay. I think, yeah, I think yeah. you had like and that you they, There was a lot to did, there's a lot been going on. There's a lot to talk about, but I think they also like got into like a jokey sort of like it's so late mm-hmm. yeah that ev- like everything becomes funny that kind yeah. of a thing so like you get into a moment like you're talking about serious things but then someone will say something and then it just like like you kind of how uh franny just corpsed like a little while ago we it, it happens to everybody you know okay so i i think then the like <laughs> the thing we come back to is teddy just standing on the edge of the couch holding the hilt of one of the swords that hasn't been put back together yet and just like like holding it out and pretending to knight one of his dads. Mm. Yeah, I love that. And um, and and then one of them will be like, oh, like oh, be careful, kiddo. You don't want to you want to knock us out like Frankie. Because <laughs> I think you yeah. would have told like that. Yeah, yeah. Oh, uh, yeah. Um, are do can we are we still making the are you still gonna make these swords for us? Um. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Cool. No, I have. Already, I already have one. Can made. this one be mine? And he holds up the the hilt that he's holding, and it's like the whatever the fanciest fucking one. Yeah, it yeah, was. yeah. It's like, oh yeah. Well, I kind of wanted that one. I'm just kidding. I don't want any of them. It's, it can be yeah, the, for sure. It can be the the Thompson sword. <laughs> don't no. Don't bring it up. Don't say it. <laughs> I don't know what you're talking I, about. Yeah, I don't know what you're talking about. Yeah. <laughs> the, it, can, it can be the Thompson it can be the, sword. It can be the... Shh! <laughs> no! Now, now, it's, now it's on stream. No, so. it's okay. Um, uh, it's fine. I love you for it. Uh, it can be. I, he I had to look at the last name. That's what happened. Yeah. That's what happened. I, I still do that for, like, Dairy, I'm pretty sure. I play <laughs> Dairy, who is 13. I think I said to somebody that whenever I need to say all of your names in succession... I always lose it. I'm just like, I'm just like, I was like, so you're all walking, Teddy, Derry, Frankie, Gertie, and if yeah. I start this way, I always forget Teddy's name for some reason. Yeah. 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 But they realize what time it is, and they're like, oh, uh, shoot. Um, uh, uh, and James is like, I will start breakfast, and uh, and Michael's like, I will. Well, I work from home. <laughs> and Michael just sits down on the couch. <laughs> Do I have to go to school today? No. I could just help you prepare for the party. Michael rolls his eyes, <laughs> and James is, from the kitchen is like, "That's a great idea." <laughs> oh yeah, kiddo. Yeah, no. Yeah, screw school for today. <laughs> for today. <laughs> Can I come to the party? Aren't you gonna be out with your friends? Oh, shit! Crap. <laughs> is what I and yep. It sure I'm, is. I'm Thirteen. <laughs> I I don't know what I don't know where I'm meeting them. I don't know I don't know anything that's happening. I need to call Derry. Oh, okay. Well, um, you know what? If it, 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 oh no, Derry's probably at school already, right? Checks watch seven thirty. Oh well, maybe not. Um, yeah, sure. <laughs> call call Derry. Um, Derry, what are you up to? Um, okay, so. No, no, no joke. Before, even before you had asked before, I was going to have Derry fake sick because he just doesn't want to go to school today because it's Halloween. Yeah. I promise that's not a reaction. I'm not metagaming. Um, but yeah, so I was going to say, I think Derry is bundled up on the couch just like trying to look bad. Okay. Um, and the first one to come out is is Vahid. Cool. And Vahid will... <laughs> Grandpa, I'm playing sick. Can you be on my side? <laughs> oh, yeah, I mean, like, we were, you know, no, don't worry. And t- he touches his nose, like, as, like, a, I gotcha, I gotcha. And uh, and then both your parents come in the room, and they're like, and they're like oh, uh, Derry, you slept on the on the couch tonight? What? Derry, are you okay? I couldn't. Derry, what's I, wrong? And I, then, and then, by the way, he's sick. <laughs> he's dying. No, I'm not dying. He's it's never not looked that bad. worse. And he's like, <laughs> oh, Mom, Dad, I can probably. Look, just look at that. And he comes around and grabs oh, your face. Have... He's like, look at this. Look at it. And it's like elongating your cheeks to make you look like shit. Um, <laughs> Look, look, and he and he has some makeup on his fingers, and he's like, while while he's like touching your face, he's like he's like shading in to make you look like very, um, like 
just thin and bad and um and like highlighting like uh, in areas and like doing that very quick it's like look oh gosh look at this face and it's like while like doing that is like rubbing makeup just on your face <laughs> oh it's awful oh and look at the bags under these eyes i can't believe it <laughs> mom I, I love by, by the time like yeah, yeah. he pulls yeah. his hands away your both your parents are like yeah oh. <laughs> looks like an old man and I, I just darius wants to say i think i'm fine i can probably make it I should no, go to school. No, 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 no. Stay in that couch. It's Why do really we say couch. stay in bed but not in couch? Well, you're on a couch. <laughs> yeah, but you're on a bed. But Stay on that couch and in it. <laughs> um, and then... Uh, <laughs> it wraps up in like a... It's like a cocoon. It's just head out at this point. Uh, and then your, your mom comes Some over. Cushions. Your mom comes over to like feel your forehead. Uh, and then he's like, No! It's contagious. <laughs> and I like coughing like, into Vi- the couch. Vi- is like coughing as well. And I want to just try to like I want to try to work up a sweat. And, and, Vi- and Vi- he turns around and like goes uh, and touches his face a whole bunch of times. I was like, oh! <laughs> I love the heat. Baba, are you sick too? Oh, I'm so sick. Oh, I'm no, so I got sick. you. Oh no, I'm so sick. I have to stay in my room all day. Oh, no. Well, if I get the With energy, my... I'll bring you tea and a cookie. Thank you. Oh, if you hear my trains moving, they're not. <laughs> <laughs> okay, grandpa. I'll be in bed. <laughs> my tiny locomotives will not be moving. <laughs> I will be, I'll be building nothing today. Here, mom, dad, let me help you get. Let me let me help you get ready to go. I can give you a hand. Uh, no, 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 I can't. No, 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 no. I can't. I'm sorry. And you stay there, and you don't breathe on us, and you don't say our, our names, and you don't. <laughs> anyway, so you, uh, uh, the phone begins ringing. Oh. Um. And there's a pigeon outside. <laughs> uh, Listen, y'all, I'm trying. No, it was great. I, I think, I mean, no one has moved the couch. I think I'm still closest to it. So I will I will grab it and answer. Oh. Hey, Derry. Hey, Teddy. Um, what are we, where are we meeting for, where are oh. we meeting for, uh, I don't know, Halloween Teddy. Tonight? I'm sick. <coughs> oh, sorry. Yeah. Um, are you still coming to Halloween? Yeah, um, if I, if I, I'm probably not gonna be feeling better by then. Uh, what are my parents still, still they're here? They're in the kitchen, and they're well, like, um, they're, I, yeah. Um, well, hey, that's, I'm, that's, I'm, that's, I'm, I'm fine, I'm fine, uh, I'm fine. I'm really I'm sorry to hear I'm that you're, that they, they, oh, what? I'm sorry. fine, I'm fine. Oh, I'm fine. Okay. Why did you tell me you were sick? Because I don't want to go to school. I was oh, up really late. Like, okay. like, really late. I was up till like 1, 1.30. Okay. Might have been 2. That's I lost track after like one. I was up like super late, so I got like no sleep. Yeah, I understand the feeling. Yeah, yeah. We've had a couple of late nights, but uh huh. Um, yes, I'm just I'm I'm home home for the day. Um, I might I might get out at some point, but um, I don't know what the plan is. I I don't know. We should probably do you have the walkie talkie? Don't don't you don't I you don't. It. I don't. That's right. Yeah. But Derry doesn't know that. Yes. Frankie well, has the walkie talkie. Mm-hmm. Yes. <laughs> I'm, sure, I'm sure Gertie has a plan. Like I, I you um, know. yeah, I, I, I dropped it. Um, oh. Can I have your help with something? If you're not gonna go to school anyway. Uh, I mean, yeah. I, I figure if if you're not gonna go to school, maybe we can get some practice time in. Okay. And then, and then I need your help with something. Well, it's not a bad idea. Um, I, I was gonna kind of make a quick shopping trip, so I can do that either on the way or. or... If you feel like going shopping, uh, I'll, I'll yeah. come over and meet you. We can figure it out. Uh, well, I should come I, over and meet you because we can we can oh. practice at your place, right? Oh yeah, duh, sure. Um, give, or you give, can come over here. I, or you can come over here. Like either way, no, it's, it's okay. Really the same. Either, either way, it's fine. I mean, if we're gonna practice. We should do it here. Yeah, but I mean, if but if, just... I'm, but if we're gonna go shopping first, then I should come meet you. That's true. So do you want to go shopping first, or do you want to do band practice and then shopping and then the thing you need help with? I don't know. I'm. Or do you want to do the thing you need help with first and get that out of the way? I mean, I think it's going to take a while. And your mom, like, starts coming through the room. <laughs> Derek was, like, way overboard. Derek? Hey, Derek, are you okay? Are you okay? Mary. What happened? Derek has to pretend to pass out Mary. because they're not, not how to what? recover Derry? from that. Uh, Derek, hang, hey, hang, re- hang the receiver. Derek. And she's going to get kind of close to the receiver. Derek. Is this? Are you okay? Hold on, Teddy. Hello? 
Teddy? Hello? Is that Teddy? Hello? I can't get any closer to the phone because Hello? it's contagious. It's contagious. Is that Baba Vahid? No, it's <laughs> Hello? No, it's Derry's mother. Anyone? It's contagious. What is? The phone. <laughs> what? Because Okay, so <laughs> um uh Frankie, you and Marcus uh, eat your breakfast that is brought to you by a nurse that um, pedestrian had to tell to <coughs> go bring to. And um, uh, and then uh, after you eat, uh, Marcus like gets his clothes back on and he's ready to leave. So do you want to just get wild and like blow something up? Um, do you want to just get wild and like, have a good time with your father. I'm blowing something up. Oh well, okay. So uh, I've uh, the committee has thought about your plan of blowing something up, and we have deemed it dangerous. Which is why it is approved by the Department of Fun and Excitement. Mm, but you, you see, uh, the the McKin committee of uh, responsibility and understanding has. Um, I'm sorry, but the ability to veto anything from phone and excitement, so... But did they first file the appropriate paperwork with the Department of Hijinks? Um, we do have the the HCC, the B3, the 13ZF, and the Code 4. Well, you really need to get the R3 in triplicate. R3. The rest is kind of... That's always... That's your... more just bureaucrat, I, bureau, I feel it. Bur 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 bureaucracy. Okay, you got us this time, but we're not going to forget that R3 in triplicate next time. You will. Watch yourself. So you want to go blow up some fire yeah, hydrants, we'll I guess, and then like up, play in the rain, I guess? Sure. I do kind of want to blow something up. Right. I feel like we've just had a lot of near-death experiences, I suppose, you know? So let's just like... Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Yeah, there was definitely some stuff that happened last night that is um, aggressive. Think, like, if we died today, there are so many things that we will never get to see destroyed. <laughs> Can we blow up a box of Go-Gurt? <laughs> oh, that sounds goopy and amazing. What if we just, like, cut a little hole inside and then stick, like, a little, like, dynamite inside and then it's just, like... A little dynamite? Just a little dynamite. Well, I don't you got have dynamite any. laying I around. I don't, but with parental are... permission, you need to be 18 in the state of our state. <laughs> <laughs> That's true. We do. So, um, yeah, yeah. Marcus will go and get get in the get in the car, and, um, because uh, Phoebe had walked home, so the car is still there. So you get in the the minivan, and uh, we'll begin taking. You to like places where you can get like you know so something like some firecrackers or fireworks or like just stuff that will explode that isn't necessarily dynamite because I have no idea where you would possibly get that <laughs> in a small town. Oh man, I heard, I heard Belinda sells it. No, Belinda sells salads. Does she? It's a front <laughs> <laughs> for all your organized crime needs. Uh, Gertie. <clears throat> Breakfast is done. No, it's not. <laughs> <laughs> okay, breakfast She's is still going. still holding the pop tart. <laughs> now I'm no no now I'm uh, moved on to hot chocolate. Oh, hot chocolate. I had him brew me because I didn't get to have yeah. mine last night because nice. that's just. And he's got the nice pink marshmallows. It does have with the slight strawberry hint. Yeah. Um, De Declan is like. And a pinch of salt. And just a little bit of salt. Thanks. Um, Declan has uh, begun getting into a costume. Um. Um, so, I mean, you're welcome to stay here for a little while. If anybody comes up the stairs, there's an emergency exit out the back. Are you going to school? I'm sorry, what? Are you going to school? Well, yeah, I was planning Why? on it. Why go to school? Yeah. Because it's a school day. Well, I was thinking. You're not going to ask me to skip, are you? <laughs> oh, no, I owe you one. Because <laughs> I asked you to skip, and you did it. <sighs> I'm in hell. <laughs> <laughs> what are we gonna do if we skip there's so much time out of the day I mean I barely know how to fill my weekends we could play D&D &D.
<laughs> Declan's head is about to explode. Um. <laughs> and he like knocks on the wall of his treehouse twice. <laughs> And like you know those ir- ir- you know those ironing boards that like come out yeah. of the or, or like a um what's the type of bed uh uh uh, uh yeah. that I hate um, Johnson yes. bed. Yeah. Uh, uh, I know. No, not Johnson. It has like a person name. It does. Uh, Murphy. A Murphy, Murphy bed. Murphy bed. Yeah. Yep. I, I yeah. like them as a concept. I hate them. In other, I, I hate them as something you have to deal with as part of a theatrical set. They, they can be. They. they uh, uh, it's hard to make them work. Yeah. But they're so cool. Um, yeah, so, like, he, he pounds the wall twice and, like, just, like, a, a nice, like, very detailed wooden crate, like, falls, like, out this, out, out, like, on a shelf. And he goes over and he, like, opens it up and the lid is to you, Gertie. And, on, and it is, like, light. and it is incredibly, like, detailed dragon, like, breathing fire uh, on, like, uh, uh, with, like, a knight, um, with a knight holding up a shield and, and that kind of thing. And it's all done in wood. It's, like, and it's not, like, scorched wood. It's, like, carved it's into engraved? the wood. Yeah, it's, oh, like, shit. Yeah. Declan, where did you get this? I made it. Really? And he pulls out uh, wooden dice trays and stuff. Um, and then he has a wooden... Um, what do you mean gun- you don't know how to fill your weekends? Clearly this took a really long time. Well, yeah, but I finished this like two years ago and I haven't had a project since. You I mean- make another set and then you start selling them, Declan. Oh, Did well, you know you can make a fortune? Do you know how... Fortune with D&D, come on. Nobody's ever made a billion dollars in one hour with D&D before. <laughs> 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 Congratulations, Christopher. Yeah, congratulations. We're very happy for you. <clears throat> I mean, I just do it for fun. It's like a hobby. I, I, I mean, I don't know. It's pretty cool, I guess, but I don't know who would pay. I mean, D&D's not super popular around here, I don't think, so. You could make it popular. Oh, no, I couldn't. Wait, let's... Well, we're getting ahead of ourselves. I think we should play some D&D today, and we should watch some movies. I... I I mean, honestly, Declan, you do you. Um, I know, I know you're a goody do shoes and all. Um, uh, but I had, I had a rough couple days, and I just, um, I could really use some company. Um. Okay, hold on. Me calling you goody two shoes is out of affection. I hope that. Okay, it did feel like it at the time, but thanks for clarifying. All right, give me one, just like give me one minute, one minute. And he goes over to the, the firefighter's pole and slides down <clears throat> and goes into the, goes into uh, his home. And you hear, like, oh, hey, Bob, uh, Bob, Dad, okay, I'm going to school, bye. I love you both. Oh, no, I don't need breakfast. I already had some. No, 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 I'll go wash those dishes myself. No reason to go up there. Dad, no reason to... I'm gonna wash the di- Dad, I'm gonna wash the dishes. Okay, bye. <laughs> and then you hear the door shut um, for the for the front of the house, and you can see Declan like walking like kind of to school, and, and is like looking looking around really suspicious. And then as soon as he gets past like some some bushes, he like ducks behind them, and then like runs back into the backyard around the fence, and like pushes open a plank of wood on the back of the fence uh, back where the treehouse is and then like climbs back up the ladder to the treehouse. Hmm. Damn, Declan. Okay. That's not for skipping school. That's to run away from bullies for the most part. Have you been bullied? Have you heard me? (laughs) Of course I've been bullied. (laughs) Mm, by who? Oh, Dake Barrett, Jordan Willows, uh, Big Rob, Little Pete, uh, uh, what's... Uh, Cynthia. Yeah, Cynthia. Or was it Cindy? <laughs> <laughs> I can't really remember. Aren't they at the elementary school? Yeah, it's pretty messed up. <laughs> Sometimes I walk my brother there. Oh, right. Um, you know, Disney kid. <laughs> <laughs> Confirmed. Canon. Wait, hold on. <laughs> is that the first time it's been mentioned on, on stream that Disney is kid is? I think so. 
Maybe not. We've we've definitely established it in some yeah. in in the but meta. We, and also, in, you guys, your family does have Marcus as a roommate. Yeah, Mark. Right? Mark okay. is the roommate. Mm-hmm. Yeah. 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 Oh, Mark. 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 I think it's oh, Mark. Mark. Marcus. Marcus. Yeah. <laughs> Mark, who who is a clown? Yeah. <laughs> An unnamed clown. I completely. He does not. Real he's man. he's the clown with no name. Right. Yeah. Right. I walk through the valley on a clown with no name. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, is it? It's not walk through the valley on a horse with no name. Like you rode through the valley because walk doesn't make sense. I'm sure it's rode. I walked on a horse. But, but rode a clown. <laughs> rode a clown is not good either. <laughs> I rode on a horse with a clown with no name. <laughs> <laughs> and that's the episode title. Folks. <laughs> I rode, I rode no on a horse with a clown with no name. <laughs> I I mean, clown with no name is not a bad episode title. Wait, I rode on a horse with, <laughs> with a clown with no name. Oh my oh. god. That's like, that's the best and worst title we've ever thought of. For yeah, um, so uh, then uh, Declan starts like setting his stuff up and he's like, okay, so have you ever played D&D before? Once or twice. Once or twice, okay, cool. All right, um, it's kind of hard to play with just like one other person. I could totally run you through like, um, I got this like sweet one shot that I could do with just like one person, but I mean like, Let's let's get Frankie. Oh, I suppose. Yeah, this could be like educational. I could be like a substitute teacher. But wait, then your dad would know we're skipping. I, I think. Well, does Gertie know that Frankie has the walkie-talkie? Um. Yeah. Yes. Okay. Yeah. <clears throat> Hold on, Declan. <laughs> Hey, Frankie, are you there? So anyways, I feel like the reason why we would say in Frankie. bed but out is because you're under Frankie. the covers. Oh, okay. oh, hang on. Right. I, I, think, I mean, like, if you sleep anywhere... Oh, I'm sorry. Go ahead. Yeah. <laughs> uh, hang on. Give me one second. Mm. But it's like, but what about those beds that come out of the wall? Like, if um, you're uh, in those... Uh, Stanley bed. Uh, yeah, Stanley bed. A Murphy bed. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, a Murphy bed. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, no, Murphy bed, that's what it is. Because it's like Murphy Brown. Murphy Brown, Murphy bed. Mur- uh, Murphy's Law. Um, I'm driving. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Uh, we were having an important discussion about, you know, ideal places to sleep as well as unusual places to sleep. And they're, um, anyways. Clearly. Um, well, I was wondering, um, are you and Dad doing educational stuff today? <laughs> Dr. Professor Fox was sick today, so... Um, we are figuring we would just go right around, maybe blow stuff up, probably a box of Gogurt, because that'd probably make a pretty good, like, a goopy little mushroom cloud is kind of the picture I have in my head. That is my desired result, you know, big old pink purple. Anyways, what? Uh, that just sounds like a normal day for you. Um, well, anyway, I was, I was, um, <clears throat> um, oh, okay, you can tell Dad, but I, I wasn't planning on going to school today. I can hear everything anyway. Oh, hey, Dad. How you feeling? Um, I'm fine, but Dr. Professor Fox is is sick. So, um, so and uh, uh so uh, you know, we're just having a we're just having a good we're having a good day. Um, it's fine. I don't care if you go to school today. You had a hard night. I mean, like, I don't blame you. I don't care if you go to school for the rest of your life. That's a lie. You I don't do. mean that, Dad. Education is important. Okay, well, anyway, I was wondering if I could steal Frankie for uh, at least, like, four hours. At least four hours? Right, Declan, that's how long it's going to take. Uh, be, yeah, I mean, like, four four hours is good. I could I could get a lot done in four hours. Okay, I think, yeah. Frankie, do you want to play some D&D with me and Declan? Over. Oh, wait, over. That stuff's for nerds. Over. <laughs> <laughs> Please, Frankie. <laughs> okay, but Be a like, nerd with us, Frankie. Do I have to wear a costume or what? You can wear whatever you want. Over. What if I don't want to wear anything? People always say stuff that you said it. You said it. You said I can wear whatever I want. But I didn't at hear least, that. at least, but can you at <laughs> least just wear underwear? I mean, it's just you know. <sighs> I don't negotiate with sisters. Over. <laughs> <laughs> Frankie. Gertie. Declan's got a pretty sweet setup up here. He's got some bacon. He's got some hot chocolate. He's got some cereal. He's got some Oreo O's. He's got some hot water. He's got a Murphy bed. He's got a hand-carved wooden D&D set with a fire-breathing dragon. I think you're going to want to come over here. Over. Is it true that... I forget... (laughs) 
I don't use these as often as the rest of you guys. I don't know when to do the in the overs. Um, I do. I'm lying. I'm just trying to make excuses for my actions. Um, is it true that Declan has like a full out like tiger rug from like a real tiger? Everything you've heard is true. Oh. Even the part about the crystal chandelier. <laughs> that <laughs> is not true. <laughs> Over. But I should get one. <laughs> you better make it plastic that looks like <clears throat> crystal just in case. Oh, okay. It falls down. Uh, like so you the wanna... Phantom of the Elf. <laughs> so if I understand correctly, you want to play D&D with like just two players? Don't you need like four to six? Ideally, yes. But unless you can think of someone. I mean... <laughs> <laughs> oh, <God. laughs> I'm assuming... I'm assuming Derry and Teddy are going to school today. Um, so if you can think of anybody who'd like to play some D&D, then, yeah, have them come over. But are you looking is, at Marcus? This is, this is kind <laughs> like of the a, rear view? This is kind of a secret exclusive invitation. Over. We should invite Tara Takahashi. No. No, no, no. Abort, abort, abort. Taryn, Taryn, no. Taryn, 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 Or Sean, dead. what, yeah? Seriously? We're just chanting. I like to chant. <laughs> Dad, how old are you? Seven. No, you're not. Dad. I don't know how old I am. <laughs> <laughs> I'm 38. <laughs> what? what was I going to say? That sound about right? That's pretty young. That's super young. Yeah, it's pretty young. Not, how old is about Kirby? 38. I mean, but sure. still. Well, I guess, yeah, yeah. That's, I mean, that's, yeah. Show you. Well, you're 14. That means he was 23 when she was born. Yeah. Uh, well, I was 24. <laughs> <laughs> What's happening here? Sorry, 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 sorry. Well, um, um, I mean, my, my parents were about that age when they had me. Yeah. It's, it's like, it's, I mean, that's also about the age I am, so that's like, it's young. It feels it's young. young. I guess but it's that not would make sense. Yeah, it's not absurdly young. <clears throat> okay, whatever. I don't know. Dad, act your age, which I guess now it doesn't really matter if you're not even 40. <laughs> Whoa. Is he too old to play D and D? No, he's not too old. Dad, do you oh. want to come inside a treehouse and play some D and D? Yes. <laughs> that sounds awesome. Okay, but Dad, this is this is big. Okay, you can't, you can't. Okay, so going up inside the treehouse, you have to come in. You have to climb up. Declan, my dad's gonna play with us. Is that okay? Uh, but yeah, I guess that's fine. I mean, now that your dad knows that I'm also skipping school and I'm just gonna be uh, in hell for the rest of my life. <laughs> so, Dad, Declan's parents think he went to school. So, this has to be a real secret. Mission. Are you, uh, no, don't worry. I, I have exactly an idea of how to get Frankie and myself up inside that treehouse without those parents knowing. We're going to kill Declan's parents by blowing up the house. <laughs> and we're going to fill it with Gogurt first. <laughs> with Gogurt first. The entire house. Oh, no. And Gertie puts away the walking talkie and looks at Declan. Please don't. Don't what? Don't blow up my house. No, no, they're not going to. No, they're not going to blow up your house. Okay. You're sitting on the button. We can still hear you. We will. <laughs> No, please don't, you guys. Dick, poor Declan. Declan, do you want to say anything? Um. Right. Uh, are you ready to roll some d20s? Right through your house foundation. <laughs> <laughs> and into some gogurt. So, uh, Teddy and Derry. Um. Well, not 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 yet. Not yet. Um. But we we could we could jump to that. But I do want to make one phone call before I leave. Yeah. Your, I, uh, your parents both left for work already, cool. and they and your mom and dad both came over to kiss you, and then they didn't. Okay. And Sorry. made it, and and we're like, <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Have a good day. Um, and as soon as I see they're gone, I'm going to sit up and reach over and grab the phone. And I'm going to dial Taryn Takahashi's number. Cool. Which I have now because she called me yep. last night. Ring and ding ding. And it's ringing. <laughs> Did we wait for me to make ringing sounds? No. Uh, so uh, I, I ring until. Hello. Uh, Hi. T- Taryn? Yeah. You going to school today? Um, no, I'm expelled. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so sorry. 
I was, your arm. I was just calling to check in on you. Um, yeah. And see if you're going to school. Oh, okay. I'm sorry. Well, I, I I'm not. Goodbye. <laughs> I'm going to go to Teddy's house. <laughs> oh, oh. <laughs> Did you forget she was expelled? <laughs> <laughs> Makes sense that Derry could too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Late night up till one thirty. Late, 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 late nights, late nights um, all around. Yeah. Okay. Um. Okay. So. Wait, wasn't Teddy gonna come to your place? We never. <laughs> we know. Yeah, we didn't. We didn't decide on. We screen. didn't decide. Um. It sounds like we decided that I'm going to Teddy's to okay. start. To start. Okay. To start. To so we're gonna it. we're gonna do band practice after what else we have to do or or <laughs> or or, or yeah. yeah? You know what? We just agreed we're going to go to Teddy's house, and we're going to finish talking about it there. Because cool. my parents are listening. <laughs> Maybe. Maybe something. Yeah, yeah. Listen. Um, <laughs> they're listening on the home... The, 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 ca- the cameras and microphones they have set up throughout yeah. your house. Um, so, yes, yeah, so I'm, I'm going to Teddy's house. I think it's I'm going to walk, because I know that Teddy's not going to be into biking, and also sure. I want to be able to, like, dip out of sight Do you have to sneak out of, out of your to. house, Terry? Um, no, it's just no I'll just right? go... I'll, I'll let Grandpa know... Um, Hey, uh, Grandpa. Oh, right, sorry, you're sorry, you're sick. Like, uh, and you hear like, uh, like sh- shuffling and like, tr- like stuff like being like clamored and like stopped and like a bunch of buttons being pushed. Like, <laughs> oh, it sounds really quiet in there, and I, uh, I can clearly tell uh, that you're not playing with uh, trains. Uh, uh, uh. Uh, I'm, hey. um, oh, I'm so sick. Ooh. <laughs> the, my trains, they're my so immobile. <laughs> it's just you and me. You see, my trains are so immobile. You're so immobile. <laughs> Um, do you want a quick hand with that before I head out? Wait, oh, I'm sorry. Oh, Derry. Yeah, it's just me and the door. Oh, okay, gone. the door opens, and it's like, they're, they're, it's there's city. some room, there, it's like train city, all mm-hmm. the trains are like He's set up. He can hat. barely mm-hmm. open the door. Yeah, he has a conductor mm-hmm. hat on and everything. <laughs> um, I just want to let you know I'm... I'm heading now. I'm going to hang out with Teddy. Uh, he's staying home, too. Um, I think we're going to go visit the twins for a minute. I want to see if I can grab something from them. But um, oh, I'll, yeah, be, I'll be okay. back. And I, I'm going to have to come back here probably to change. So I'll see you quick before Halloween. But sure. Before time. Um, I don't know your, if your grift is uh, as uh, clever as I guess you think it is. Because in my history, when you... Pretend you are sick, and you miss school. Your parents don't let you go out that evening. So, I have a suggestion, and we're gonna get found out, and it might cause some problems down the line. Okay. But halfway through the day, we both started feeling better, and I drove you to school. Mm. Okay. Do, do you, but but you're not actually gonna make me go to school. What? Of course I am. You okay. <laughs> he he winks very horribly. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay. Um. You have to go to school if you feel better. Right. <laughs> because I. I, did, if you I don't will go feel to better school, around. You three can't o'clock. go trick or treating tonight. Right. So how about you, after driving whoa, me to whoa, school? Oh, Derry, quit winking um, like that. That's gross. Sorry, I didn't uh, get a lot of sleep. I, um, oh wow, that. Uh, uh, after here, let me wipe me off school, that makeup. <laughs> um, maybe can you can you then pick me up after school, so that I can be seen getting picked up from school? Oh yeah. That would help, right? I think so. Yeah. Okay. Okay. I have to go back to sleep now. <laughs> I'm trying to Because I'm sick. It's gross. It is working. It's bad. Okay. <laughs> but it is happening. No, you need to wink like this. This is how you wink properly. So it doesn't look gross. <laughs> <laughs> so you go to Teddy's house. I'm going to go to Teddy's house. <laughs> okay. um, I'm going to go to Teddy's house. And um, <laughs> I'm going to go to Teddy's house. <laughs> Great, so you go to Teddy's house. I go to Teddy's house. That was the doorbell. Yeah. The doorbell ringing. Um, Teddy, you want to get that? Teddy's already at the door. Okay. <laughs> hey, Derry. Hey, Teddy. Uh, I'm, I'm like walking. Hey, Derry. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm sick. I'm starting to feel a little bit better. I'm so I, I'm sick. No, we heard your phone but... go from before. Don't worry. Oh. <laughs> what? 
<laughs> oh, right, because we were yeah, on the... Okay, yeah, yeah, gotcha. Yeah. We were on the... Um, All right, okay, understood. Well, then let me tell you, um, Baba had a great idea. Uh, I, I feel better in about three hours, and then he drives me to school, and then actually he's going to pick me up from school at the end of the day. So my parents let me have Halloween tonight. We're gonna we're gonna do band practice today, Dad. If you want to come, oh yeah, want to come watch? Oh yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. I love that. It's gonna be our first like um, yeah. show. like our first. And uh, I think James was saying he was gonna take the the day off as well from City Hall. So oh okay. So is he here? We'll be here. Yeah, James is upstairs. Cool. Hi, hi, James. Well, hi. 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 <laughs> James is funny. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> you're you're funny too, Dad. <laughs> sure. Yeah, well tell that to my seven thousand subscribers. I think it was eight thousand last time I checked. Did when you did, look last did, night? When did you check last You got a you got a big surge of subscribers. Wait, you checked it last night? Yeah, someone reposted you Wait, on Twitter. Wait, but I but I checked it at like lunch yesterday. You should look again. I went up by a thousand? I mean, I, it was that was the last time I checked. Well, it was oh still going God. up. And I, uh, Michael like leaves the room. <laughs> um, okay, Teddy. I think my so my dad's um, gonna be famous. I think you're, I'm pretty sure your dad is famous. Wow. I don't Holy th- like shit. on a certain Nine kind thousand. of level. Like, I, I I have a feeling by the time we're juniors, we're gonna be running into kids who know your dad, whether they know it's him or not. It better is, than it's me. gonna be weird. They'll know my dad better than me. Teddy, no one's gonna know your dad better than you. I mean. <laughs> There's a lot of kids that are into like wood carving and construction and well yeah but I mean you like, live with your dad you live with your dads and, and like and you know and you live with them your whole life no and I mean no I mean they would know my dad more than they, the kids would know my dad more than me they would know they would recognize my dad but they wouldn't recognize me because I'm not oh famous. oh 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 more than they would know you <laughs> yeah oh that makes sense yeah. that's gonna happen yeah 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 eleven thousand <laughs> wow it, my job like, dad. Room. Wait, 11,000 and what? 11,000, well... Even. Perfectly even. Well, I just rounded, um, but it was 11,000 and one. <gasps> wow. My fake account went through. <laughs> my, first, my first bot! <laughs> I don't know what that means. Oh, my God. I I went up by 3,000 subscribers overnight. Well... You said this is it. I'm hitting. 7, I'm hitting the big time. Before, Did I say seven thousand? You said seven thousand. Me four thousand subscribers. Oh <coughs> wait, I went up by four thousand subscribers in, overnight. In one night. Wow. What is this going to stop? Is it just going to keep going up? In my experience, yes. No, no, you're I mean, you're wait, going. It, it is going to stop. Gonna, no, don't, it's not going to stop. Don't screw up the next video because no. then you'll lose subscribers. That's that. I mean, it, look, here's the thing. It's really hit or miss. It's about whether it's good or not. All right, all right, yeah. all right. You gotta post consistently. Too. So the, the post consistently. Don't and screw up the next video. Is it, people really like this one for some reason? You should make the swords. Do the swords video. Oh, do the swords, swords for do one. Do swords video. Oh, okay. All right. Um, I'm gonna be I'm gonna be in our room all like all day. I have to I have I have to I have to make sure this sticks. Don't, it's for, a, wait, don't about forget about practice. the party. It's so fickle. Party. Uh, You've got yeah. a lot to do today. Ah, uh, okay. Uh, well, okay. I, I'm going to take Teddy on a quick shopping trip. Trip? Trip. Yeah. Shopping. Teddy on a quick shopping trip. And then um, uh, I'll okay. bring him back and we'll grab you for band practice. Sure. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a very long day. All right, cool. It's a lot to pack in. Okay. Well, I'm sick, so i got to make the most of it. I'm really not sure we're going to get through it in this episode. <laughs> Oh no, I'm not doing this on purpose, Sam. It's quick. Okay. Sam, we're shopping. Where are we okay, going? Okay, so uh, we're going to the twins' apartment. Um, that is not shopping. Uh, no, uh, I mean it is. It's gonna. It's it's not. It's not. Sh- it's not shopping the way that most people would shop. But <laughs> okay. we're gonna go there and we're gonna get something, and that's shopping. Where, where are um, we going? Like the center of town's like back that. Are we going to the twins apartment? Well, if you keep watching, you'll see uh, a landmark we generally only pass when we go to the twins apartment. And uh, if you look there, you'll notice that that is the twins apartment. And uh, if you see here, I am uh, knocking on the door. What's, uh, what's to the, the landmark uh, that we always pass when we go to the twins well, apartment? The, the, the landmark cinema. Uh, that's real. No, <laughs> the landmark <laughs> grocery. <laughs> I was trying to make something up, but I couldn't even do that. You have the world document open. I see it. So we have a grocery store. This is the world document. This is just my family. Oh my God, it's 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 the 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 landmark grocery. Uh 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 is is the, there's the landmark the, grocery. Sure, sure, there's, sure. Yeah, and we call it the landmark. There can be two groceries in town. Yeah. Okay. Oh yeah. Well, this is not a grocery store. <laughs> 
It's a grocery for landmarks. Um, oh, my, maybe making this whole town over complicated. They sell lawn ornaments. Um, like gnomes. Yeah. Oh, and, and, shit. Like gnomes. Oh, and also, shit. I think they also probably have, like, postcards and magnets of famous landmarks from around the world. It's okay. the landmark grocery. There it is. And if you know, we pass that one if we go to the Twin so Towers. so weird. Okay, um, cool. So I'm yeah, going to... Of course, I know the landmark grocery. <laughs> So I'm gonna I'm gonna buzz one one three, um, one one three one one three, uh, and, and the twins' names William are Mehdi, Mehdi, which Donia. is which is they them and Donia she her. Okay. Um. So one one three. You get buzzed up. Cool. Uh, open the door and walk up, and I uh, knock on their apartment door. Okay. What? Wait. So are we? What are we getting here? Um, I, I, I just want to read the closet. I need oh. like one more piece for tonight. Okay. Are you? Yeah. Wait. What are you going as? Well, you're, gonna, you're gonna see. You're gonna, like you're gonna see. You're gonna see. Okay. Okay. All right. It's for my surprise party. What do your siblings do for like work? Um, we had so we talked about this. I think, uh, they both. Here, so here's my thoughts. They both work. Uh, just at like a retail or sort of place like part time. I also think they have accumulated so much clothing. They do run like a minor like so they sell stuff out of it, not as like a big shop, but like to yeah. people who know they can come do it here, sure. which is why Dairy calls it shopping. Okay. Um. So part time, probably at the Landmark Grocery, um, since it's so close, and then uh, sure. and then they also sell stuff out of here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, cool. Um, An Etsy shop maybe. Yeah. So. Uh, Donia will open the door and like right. gr- greet you with a big hug yeah. okay. and and invite you in. Hey Doni. Hi the twins. Oh hi. Hey. Um I'm here to shop. Is this is your closet in good order? Please. Please. He really needs just one more thing for his costume. Just one little thing. Just one. I don't know what it is. It's probably something small. I'll get you twenty dollars. Like a scarf. How much you got? I can get you twenty dollars. Oh. I have two. You only twenty dollars. I, I can I can owe you I can owe you eighteen dollars if I give you two now, or I can owe you twenty and I can keep my two for candy. Wait. Oh, I'm sorry. Our um. Our coffers are a little dry. It's uh, it is uh, about your coffers. it is Halloween after all. I mean, things are flying off the shelves, and she turns and like looks at like just a bunch of clothes. <laughs> turns back, it's like oh, it's such short notice, dairy, dairy, what, dairy. What if okay? Well, here's another pitch. What if um, what if I don't buy it? What if I just take it and I'll bring it back later? Oh. And then I don't even have to pay you, so you don't oh, have to worry about it. And then we have it. to sell it at a deficit because it's used. Mm. What if I? This isn't I, a rental service. What if I wash dude. it, Tonya? I just want, I just want like a gold morph suit. I just want to see if you have like a gold what? morph suit. Oh, a gold morph suit. Well, hold on. And uh, and she like reaches to the side and pulls up a tablet and <laughs> starts swiping through it. Like, oh. is Mehdi here? Uh, m- are they around? Or are they? Yeah, yeah, they're 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 they're, they're playing Star Fox on the couch. Yeah, they're they're around. <laughs> Um, I'm just gonna sit down while Donia searches through the inventory, um, and I will I will give them a hug as well, uh, a big one. I know I know their hands are busy. Um, Reciprocated. Yes. <laughs> um, uh, Teddy, if you wanna if you wanna look for something, I don't know if you got your whole costume, but you know you just start taking stuff. I can deal with the consequences later. I just look at Donia. <laughs> uh, yeah, I mean, sure. All right. <laughs> All right, closes, like, uh, locks the tablet. Hmm, whatever you think you need, you can take. But you owe me one. And I will collect. Terry, Terry, that's never in the, like, movies, that's never the good. I'll give you half of what I owe you now. You want to know where the party's at tonight? Wait, you can't just go, you can't. Wait, I'm listening. The party? Teddy. Is it the one with the big Toblerones? It's the one with the, the big, one with Toblerones. big Toblerones. We know where it is. How? How do you how do you possibly know where it is? High well, school's changed us. We have connections now. Hmm. I'm my dad's gonna be famous. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what that has to do with what we're talking about, but when we leave good, check good check, for your dad. Check his dad's subscriber account. <sighs> 
I don't even. What your dad has a Sith? What are you talking about? Wait, hold on a second. <laughs> hey, I forgot. People like don't know that it's yeah. your dad. Maybe, maybe it is. Uh, on his old, old, old Twitter, you might not be able to find it. It's so old. Followers. Oh, yeah. oh, sorry. Scary. Sorry. Come on, Philly. Uh, um, but we can tell you where the party is. Yeah, we can tell you where the party is. Yeah, you should have already done that. Okay, Let's well, hear it. but we need to hear Do you, you have a gold morph suit? Yeah, we need I, to We know. have a gold morph suit. Yeah, now tell me where the party is. Teddy, what's your address? What? Uh, <laughs> my address. <laughs> it's at my house. <laughs> it's at the Thompsons. Yeah, my dads are hosting the this year. They're throwing a banger. A banger? <laughs> what's a banger? A banger. I heard it on a show. Oh. It means like You party. know it's a great party? A banger and smash? Yeah, that's that's the theme of the party, actually. I didn't know what that meant. Huh. I assume they heard it from a TV show. Yeah. As I've heard half of that phrase on TV. <laughs> All right. That's half. I'll get you the rest. I'll be back. Oh, you will. Okay. Grab the morph suit. Okay. Uh, Can and I grab something too? Three aisles down. <laughs> cool. Um, I'm gonna three say three uh, aisles down. I also I look at a ton of stuff. Like Derry is very much like ooh 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 everything that's interesting. He doesn't see boundaries with this place because it's his yeah, family. Yeah. So like why should he? Um, so he is very much making a little bit of a nuisance. Um, and uh, she'll uh, Donia will look at you when you ask like can you have something and Donia will will just be like. Yeah, whatever. Just like, make sure you bring it back. Thanks, the twin. Uh, and also, <laughs> it just goes yeah, into yeah. the twins. Thanks, the twin. <laughs> My name is Donia. <laughs> Teddy, okay. Teddy never learned to distinguish between the two of them, and he feels really bad about it. But he well, yeah, they are identical now, twins. Now yeah. he can't ask, and so it's mm-hmm. it's like this whole thing. Yeah. Cool. Um, cool. So Frankie, you and Marcus park the minivan down the block. And you're cutting through people's yards. All right. So here's what we're going to do. I'm going to go and knock on their door. And I'm going to say, hey, isn't it great how I saw both of our children walking to school together today? (laughs) Isn't that wonderful? (laughs) And they'll say something probably like, why, yes, Marcus, that is wonderful and great. <clears throat> Please, would you come in? And I'll say, oh, no, no, thank you. Oh, shoot. But I did leave something. No, but my, no, but um, I think one of my kids left something up in your tree house. And they'll say, oh, we'll get it for you. And I'll say, no, I'll get it for you. Me. <laughs> huh. Frankie, can you help me? Well, I think the biggest problem with your plan is that you're not using enough direct force. You're trying to use a, I guess, subterfuge of sorts, when, which while I suppose it is playing through your strengths, I think sometimes a splash of just raw violence will sometimes, you know, ha- it works very well. Frankie, you guys have been sitting on the button this whole time. We heard the whole plan, Dad. That plan sucks. It was entirely um, deliberate. Um, Dad, you guys just need... To quietly don't don't even see if you if you if you knock on the door and you talk to Declan's parents, you're just gonna raise suspicion because that's just how his parents but are. Even if I say, "Hey, isn't it great how both of our children went to school today?" Dad, that's basically saying <laughs> our kids didn't go to school. Today. No, hold on, wait, wait. What if I say it real sincere? All right, all right. Um, hey, he grabs the walkie-talkie. Hey, um. Have you noticed how great it is that our kids walk to school together? <laughs> Isn't that awesome? Dad, you've never once talked to Declan's parents about this. Why Why would you do it today? <laughs> well, you're right. I should open up with something I have talked to them about before. Um, oh, shoot. I've never talked to them before. <laughs> Dad, Dad, I think you just, you guys just need to quietly. Declan, can you help them out? Um, uh, just cut. Oh, um, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. So, if you go through the, my backyard, there's there's a wood fence that goes all the way around, and there's a and there's a plank of wood that you can push out from the bottom that like rotates so that well, Frankie will be able to fit through it, but Marcus, you won't, you you will not because you're big and you're an adult. It sounds like what you're saying is we need a distraction. 
and I have just the idea. Gogurt explosion. I was thinking the same thing. It's like we're related or something. You are my son. <laughs> so you hear an explosion. <laughs> So you hear an explosion out in front of the, um, I mean this sincerely, out in front of the Rose family household. Declan, I am so sorry. Uh, uh, what's going on? Um, they're creating a distraction. And Declan like looks out the w- one of the windows of the of the treehouse, like out to the front. <laughs> At least he's distracted. <laughs> and um, uh, on like the sidewalk in front of their home is a like a box full of gogurt that has just exploded and is like everywhere and the and the rose parents uh, and mark all go out and and mark is like oh sweet <laughs> i love gogurt and being a clown um <laughs> those are my two favorite things and the, and the rose the rose parents are like like very confused and you can see them you can't hear them or anything but they're like, what the and like they're looking around and then um you hear climbing up the ladder. Uh, oh, sh- sh- and, and Marcus, like, uh, Marcus with Frankie on his shoulders, like, pokes up over the... We're both a little splattered. <laughs> <laughs> we may have not nailed the timing perfectly, but I believe we escape with no witnesses. Get in here. All right, so they're, they're all up there. Oh man, yeah. Who do you think? What do you think they're gonna do? I might just watch them for a little while because it's pretty funny. Dad, what's up? What's up? Oh, we're here to play D and D. Yes, but also I'm having mixed feelings right now. I I love you so much right now, but I also I'm realizing I'm almost I'm almost older than you. Well, you're mature. Like, you're like twice my age. I'm seven, as I said. Right. You're 14. This, this is such a weird. Going on 15. Da 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 da. <laughs> Can I be elf? <laughs> like Buddy the Elf? No, like Elf on the Shelf. Oh. Yes, Buddy the Elf. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, we yeah, have we. I guess we can start looking at characters, right, Declan? Yeah, Declan like breaks out a bunch of character sheets. It's like, okay, uh, but these are these are um, they're they're marker board character sheets. They're laminated. They're yeah, they're laminated. So you can, uh, you use these uh, wipe away markers, and um, so you can like do your stats and stuff. And they're like, velcroed on. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, so yeah, that happens. Um, uh, just just because I have a question, for Frankie. Um, what happens when my parents uh, decide to like determine where that gogurt explosion came from? What? Because I mean, like, effectively, they could feel like that was some sort of an attack. Well, I guess that's a problem for the future. Gertie. How do you live like this? <laughs> I guess I've just become used to it. She's also an enabler at times. I am sometimes. The trick, Declan, is to get a kick out of it. I feel like you've always struck me as an individual <laughs> and voter. Make school cool. Uh, I'm sorry, make school cool. But I suppose if you want to spell it out, yeah, but I feel like it was kind of a Oh, wait, it's play. meant to be cool? Well, yeah. I mean, you don't, oh, you nobody don't call is school reading it that stool. Way. <laughs> But maybe we should call stool stool. I would like to open the first stool. <laughs> Was that Marcus? Yes. That's Dr. Professor Marcus. Marcus, is drunk Marcus. Today. Marcus, I think Marcus might still be concussed. <laughs> oh, is that how you're playing it? Oh, God, I just hit the microphone. Oh. I've been hitting the microphone. Bad, bad, bad microphone. All right. All right, so I think what we should do is invite a few more very special guests and do an entirely special episode of us playing D&D oh in God. character. We're not going to get through Halloween this episode. We're not going to get through Halloween oh this God. episode. Maybe a month from now. Jesus. Here's the good thing, though. We will get to Halloween next episode. Oh, my God. Well, it is Halloween. It is Halloween. It's Halloween day. <laughs> but we will get to, like, actual Jesus. Halloween next episode. I'm so... Sorry, please. No, please, it's fine. I'm cool So it, it gives you a just, chance to dress um, up. Yeah. Oh, I have to buy a gold morph suit. Shit. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> I'm gonna be a Tetris piece that was like an L shape that we've modified, so it's just a gun. <laughs> That's Frankie's costume. Wait. Which, which piece? Which gun? 
Is it's it, an L piece. An L. Oh, you said L. And you just put like a trigger oh, on sure. it. Oh, sure. And a hammer. Sure. And then you like paint it but like kind of black and silver. Gun? You could be a water gun. <laughs> and then you just like, you like when you push it, it like squirts. I was thinking it would be a gun gun, and I would actually be a gun that shoots water guns. <sighs> And then it's like, ha ha, hey, your hands don't have a water gun. Click, click. Now they do. <laughs> yeah, haven't you thought about it? Click, click, um, motherfucker. <laughs> click, click, motherfucker. <laughs> no. <laughs> um, okay, so. Can we have a quick scene where we just see Baba Vahid solo playing with his hands? <laughs> I think we need that right now. Okay. Wait. Yes, you see Baba Vahid playing with his trance. <laughs> Good scene. Good scene. I love everyone. this show. Uh, and he goes, choo choo. <laughs> choo choo, <laughs> motherfucker. <He> tips- <laughs> <laughs> okay. That- Baba Vahid loves to cut. <laughs> yes. Uh, what are the two of you doing? Uh, we're leaving the apartment building, I think, with a couple okay. of garment bags. I have a gold uh, morph suit in one of them. Um, I have the rest of my costume at home already. Did T- Teddy end up finding anything? Teddy found, you know the, the green hoodie, dark green hoodie that he always wears? Mm-hmm. He found another one, and it's like... Like the same one? Yeah, it's or, like okay. the same one, but it's like slightly nicer. <laughs> okay. And so he grabbed that. Sweet. <laughs> That's awesome. Great. Um, so we're sharing that um, as we're going. I think they're just like, okay, so we need to do your thing, and we need to go to band practice, and then we got to meet up with the foxes and figure out what's the plan for tonight. So um, I picked the first thing. What do you want to do next? Yeah. Um, I, I, mean, I think Is your thing can, quick? We can do that I, really know, I think we can do my thing later. Um, yeah? Like after like after band practice? Oh, yeah. we have to go to school to be picked up, or at least I do, uh, at four. Why don't... Well, yeah, I mean, I guess... I guess we've got our first... I guess we've got our first concert, Derry. You saying the first syllable of concert made me sweat from every pore. Like, 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 in nerves. <laughs> like, I was excited for band practice, and now I think I don't want to do it. Now I think I'm actually sick. Can well, we, we walk slow? We no, no. no we, don't ha- we don't have to do a concert. We can just publish the EPs and then, you know, and then never do anything. Uh, you know what? Um, no. We get- Wait, what if we get helmets like Daft Punk? <laughs> well... And they wouldn't see our face, and then we wouldn't be famous, and then... That's true. It's less of the point. It's a flaw in the plan. I think instead, maybe, your dad just watches with his eyes closed and his ears covered. Okay. And we'll start there. Yeah, that sounds good. Is he going to be cool with that? I'm sure he will be. Okay. Um, let's go to your house and grab him. Okay. We cannot do the scene of band practice today, for I have left my saxophone. That's, no. <laughs> that's okay. You're not going to get there. Okay. We will go into Teddy's house right now. Yeah, because on the cool. way... Back to Teddy's house. You die. You both die. No, um... Wait, hold on. I rolled an eight. I don't eight, think eight so. Eight to not die. Eight to Plus not three die. if it's an adult killing me. <laughs> 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 and plus three if they're killing me, and and if they didn't kill me, I'd be able to protect my friends. Hmm. Um, cut, I cut to, cut to a, a voyeuristic shot through some bushes watching the two of you walk down the sidewalk. And then cut to both of you walking down the sidewalk, and... So, I, I mean, I, I really think... I mean, we're going to have... Well, we're playing for, for Frankie's... Yeah. I mean, when you he jumps I, the gorge. You hear an explosion. Yeah. Whoa. It's like, it's like a, a it's block... Wet. It's like a block... It's like a couple blocks down, and it's wet and goopy and... Hmm. You know what I'm going to do, what? Roll flight? It's a 16 to fly... <laughs> Away so from 60, the sun. Yeah, yeah. Um, t- Teddy, Teddy, wait! And I'm gonna chase after. Um, that fight. Um, uh, two. I'm gonna add protective. If that makes sense. So sure. five. Five. Teddy, wait! Teddy, wait! Teddy, wait! Teddy just gonna, like gets. Gonna... Uh, t- Teddy gets to the end of the street. Realize, like, ha- like it's like that moment of like, oh wait, why am I running? And then like turns around and sees you at the other end of the street. <laughs> what am I scared of? Okay, while I was running, I realized what a real uh, increased heart rate feels like, and I was just nervous. Uh-huh. Um, I think I can do a, sh- uh, a concert tonight as long as it's just for your dad. Gary, what was that? I don't know. I don't know. But I feel like if we're investigated, we're gonna get pulled into some like really spooky shit, and I, I I'd rather not. I'd rather have like a day off from like big noises and monsters. Yeah. Um, I feel that. Yeah. 
I'm gonna start keep walking towards Teddy's house. Cool. All right. Um. Uh. Also, also Teddy. Uh. Was, oh no, we we address that. Never mind. Cool. Um. Yeah. Da- are we still on the way back to Teddy's? Yeah, you can be. Yeah. Um. Derry, I. I f- um. Since I lost the walkie-talkie, mm-hmm. um, I just sh- should we call Gertie? Because oh. we still don't know what's going on with Halloween, right? We don't know That's where true. we're meeting everyone. And we don't know if Marcus is okay because he, I think, because last week, last week he was going to the hospital, yep. right? Yep. So that so, um, that's probably not a bad idea. Um, you'd have to have a phone, right? We can. But you have a phone. <laughs> <laughs> you take off your backpack. You open it up, you pull out a bag, or like a box, you open the box, you pull out a Ziploc bag, or whatever. <laughs> Anybody seen Russian Doll? Or, 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 or Russian Doll? Anyone seen Russian Doll? Uh, sorry, a Russian Doll? Uh, and inside the phone is a I smaller phone. I have not charged this phone in a while, so I'd like to roll something. Roll to uh, two depletion dice. Is <laughs> yeah, probably the perfect roll. Uh, I'm gonna roll brains. Okay. To see if it still has a charge on it. That's a one. That's a one. This uh, this phone's dead. Well, you did really... not remember. You did not remember to charge it. This and this... mark adversity. This is despicable. <laughs> I don't really know why I carry this phone around if I don't ever charge it. Well, you can charge Seems... it when we get home, and, and we can call from your dad's phone. Um, also, I just want to I want to clarify that I was never nervous about the concert at the Gorge, but that's because that's like off in the future. Yeah. The idea of it being today still does fill me with a little bit of dread, but yeah. I think it's the kind of dread I can use. Okay. And channel it into our art. Yeah. Maybe that's what we call the first album. Channel the dread channel into your dread. Our, channel your dread. Channel your dread. Channel your dread. Channel your dread. So, Declan has been explaining all like the character creation to Marcus uh, specifically who is kind of not getting it and um 36 and drop the lowest what I'd be yeah I'd be like so some dungeon masters uh are a little more harsh than I am but like you know it's like you roll you roll the d6 so you want I just want you to have like stats that you you can be happy with at the beginning you know I'm feeling pretty good about my halfling I got an A how many dice did you roll? <laughs> two? Four. You roll four, you drop the lowest. Oh. Well, I only have two. <laughs> and I got a nine. Wait, eight and died? Yeah. Wait, what were the numbers? Frankie, you don't, you don't immediately add them together. You need the... What's the lowest one? What was the lowest one? I forgot the first two. I just know they added up to eight. I think a three, perhaps a four. That doesn't add up to eight. Well... That's seven. That seems to be the numbers problem, not mine. So start start over, Frankie. Start over. All right. Well, I re- well now you just got... It was, it was a four and another number. Which a four equals- and a five. So you got a four. All right. And a four. So eight. Well, but what about the six? You forget about the six because you drop. Oh, you dropped the lowest number. See, right, you Declan? don't. Wait a minute. You got a six and you were. Wait, six, four. So six, five, four. Wait, Declan, did you say you dropped the lowest yeah, number? Yeah, dropped the lowest oh, number. Oh, so start over. <laughs> what, what, hang on. Okay, great. So back at the uh, at the, the Thompson top house. house. No! We'll get back. We'll get back. That's very funny. No, we don't um, know the number off the top of our head. Um, well then, I don't know, I don't know how you expect to make a phone call. Who doesn't keep a book? Yeah, don't Who we, doesn't we, keep a book? Is it for a book? cell phone? Wait, what are you trying to do? Are we calling a landline? We're just calling the Fox's house. Any oh, of them. Oh, we're calling the Fox's house? Yeah. I, you just kept saying we need we to need call We need to talk Gertie. to Gertie. Yeah. yeah, and I know Gertie has a cell phone. Yeah. So I didn't think to call a landline. We oh. have, we have the Fox house. It's just hit two. Just pick up the phone, hit two. Pick up the phone and hit. <laughs> Teddy picks up the phone and hits two. Well, yeah, yeah. Oh, Teddy, oh yeah. We <laughs> both, <laughs> what, each, each, we're both holding one end of the phone. And you, uh, oh, hello. 
What can I? Uh, this is uh, this is Phoebe <laughs> Fox of the Fox household. It's Teddy and Derry are too busy laughing. They're just laughing into the phone. <laughs> can we roll to see who's holding the mouth end? I don't know, oh my god, you it's are! Dairy. You are! It's dairy. I'm holding both ends. No. Oh wait, so I'm listening hey. and you're speaking. <laughs> Hey, hey, Gertie. Um, it's no, Derry. It... Oh. I'm just calling to see what's up, what the plan is for tonight. No, this is Phoebe. It's Fe- she says it's Phoebe. Phoebe knows. Phoebe has the. This is Phoebe. You're Phoebe. This is Phoebe. Yeah. Phoebe. On the f- end. That, Wait, that's Phoebe. That's Phoebe. Wait, ask, her, ask her if she means Teddy? Phoebe Fox. Yeah, Phoebe Fox. Teddy okay. and Derry. Hey, Phoebe. Um, do you know where is Gertie there? Sh- stop. Hold on. Hold on. Wait. Can what's going on? Are you doing something? Yeah. Oh, yes. We say yes. We're doing something. Yeah, we're doing something. Well, Teddy, I can hear you talking. Yeah, I'm holding one end of the phone. Wait. Oh, are you? Wait. Tell you're... her. Oh no. Uh, I'm holding, and I'm holding. Tell the... her. Can Derry not hear me? I, um, no. Tell. Okay. <laughs> Phoebe. Hi. It's Teddy and Derry. We're trying to get a hold of Gertie to see what the plan is for tonight. Is she there, or did she go to school? I'm sick. <laughs> okay, a uh, couple of things. Why aren't the two of you at school? I'm sick. She's, she's asking. Oh, she's asking why we're both at, not at school. Can you make this easier on me? Please put me on speaker or something. Is there speak? Dad, Dad, is there a speaker on this? Um, yeah, there's speak. There's speaker. Which yeah. button? The Which one button that is looks it? like a, a, a. Teddy hangs up the call accidentally. No. <laughs> I hit the redial button. Here, okay, here's here's something really funny about this. I was at Dairy's like pretty decent with technology. This this is just an exception. This is well. This is <laughs> a, oh, it's an old phone. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. yeah. This is a corded phone that the Thompsons still. Have. So would a corded so, phone have a speaker phone? Or no. Speaker? This well, is, it doesn't need to be. I it's mean, an well, advanced. It's, it's not a corded phone. It's not either. corded. It's a landline, but it's not corded. It's a landline. Right? Yeah. And, and you can pull it off the receiver. Mm-hmm. It's more fun if it's corded. <laughs> Fine, it's it's corded, but it's corded. It, but it, it, it doesn't speak really long. I hit the speaker button, but the volume's all the way up. Okay, the so the speaker's on the handset. So what? The room. What? Quiet. I can't. I'm speaking. I'm practically whispering. How do I turn her down? Um, there's volume. Uh, you just Teddy hangs up the phone. No, again. <laughs> I turned on the volume. I hit speaker. I call her back. Hello. Hi. Can you hear me? I can hear you. Can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you. Teddy can. Yes, you can hear her. Can you hear Teddy? Yes. Okay. Wait. Yeah. Okay. Cool. What am I holding? A phone. <laughs> Oh no! I call her back. <laughs> okay, so do you know where Gertie is? No, I was gonna ask you if you knew where Gertie was. You don't know where Gertie is? I don't know where Gertie is. Oh, she wants well, to go on I don't know where you? Gertie is, and I don't know where BB is. I thought she might have been at school. Uh, but I didn't want to call school in case she wasn't there because I didn't want them to think I didn't know where my daughter was. So I called school and told them that she, uh, she was sick. And then wait. they said, okay. And then I was like, okay, she's not at school. Oh. Are okay. you two okay? You're well, I, I'm okay? sick. Um, I'm starting to feel a little bit better. I think I might be able to get to school for like the second half of the day. Well, yeah, y'all um, went through quite a lot last night. Yeah, I couldn't get to sleep till like one. Gertie told me everything, by the way. You've got some catching up to do, Derry. Um, um, it's fine. Okay. Like every... Um, like everything? Sure. Yeah, like everything, everything. Wait, am I still on speaker? Yeah. <laughs> and my and Michael is like, what's everything? Teddy is... Also 17,000. Mm-hmm. Wow! That's so... That's amazing, Dad. Um, How are the swords? Well, uh, hold on. And Michael like, comes into the room holding a laptop. And he's like, what's, what's everything? Can we make this a conference call? Listen, Phoebe... You weren't supposed to know about my special surprise party, but I guess, do you want to come when I get it all together? Yeah, I mean, now like... Know, now that you know about it, it feels weird to not invite you. You know what? I was wondering why there was all this decoration down in my basement. Was that, is that where you're holding the surprise party? Yeah. <clears throat> that isn't... That's 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 ended as always. It was, it was the plan. Let's get a flight. Yeah. <laughs> Eight, I'm I'm using rebellious. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And, and protective, actually, would protective? No, nah, not no. I'm only protecting myself. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So eight. So eight. Mm-hmm. Um. Yeah, Michael. 
is there for a second. I was like, oh, that's really nice. Huh. Well, are you going to go to that party instead? Oh, I, um, I haven't, I haven't settled on a date. It doesn't have to be tonight. I could do my special surprise party whenever. Oh, okay, cool. Yeah, it's um, just like, hey, it's like a... 18,000. This is nice. Amazing. Oh, you got to keep an eye yeah, on that. Yeah, I will. Okay. See you, everybody. Okay. Um, Phoebe, Teddy, can I tell you guys something? Yeah, I'll watch out. I have no idea what I'm going to do about this party. I just started talking about it. I think I was covering for another lie, and I'm, like, in deep, and I feel like everyone's expecting a lot out of me right now. I mean, like, isn't, isn't everybody you've said something about the party to, aren't they all the people who know why you're lying? I mean, why you're saying that? I didn't know the surprise party was a lie. Wait, is this a surprise party? Well, now I want to do it. But I kind of just started talking about it. As okay, like where's thing. my daughter? <laughs> I don't know. Um, We can get on it. Teddy lost his walkie-talkie, so we can't get her that way. It, I can just call... I have her number. What? Okay. Okay. Well, um, can can you call her? Actually, can we have her number? We, we can wait like five minutes if you want to call her first. Yeah. Right. Or wait, can we put? Can we conference call? Um. Uh. No. Yes. I don't know. I've never done it. Phoebe, can you conference call? What you mean if I call someone and they put you on the yeah. line? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, okay. I'm gonna thing, call. Right? I'm gonna call. <laughs> I'm gonna call Gertie. And then I will call you and tell you when I'm done, and then okay. you can call Gertie. Okay, thank Great. you. Great. Thank cool. you. Charge your phone. Goodbye. And Phoebe hangs up, and then uh, back to the treehouse. So I'll roll a 20, and then I'll roll the 20 again, and that's how much damage I do? <sighs> I mean, we're still trying to roll your stats, Frankie. I... You don't roll a twenty with with your stats. Well, it's well it, the numbers you keep saying are like tens and twelve. So why can't I just roll a twenty? Let's let's put a pin in stats. Why don't you figure out what your character looks like, Frank? Ring, ring. Totally, awesome. Ring, yeah, ring, well, ring. so go go into it. Ring ring. Um, or or is it on is on vibrator <laughs> silent or? Um, no, it could be ring ring. I just don't think Gertie would realize it was. I think I want my character's hair to just be like fire. His hair is just ring, 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 ring. fire. Her hair. It's gonna be a her. Okay. Yeah. All right. So and she literal fire. fire from, yeah, literal, literal fire. fire. Okay. Shoots fire. <gasps> from everybody quiet. It's my mom. <gasps> oh, Marcus, no. be quiet. It's my mom. <laughs> Your mom. <laughs> Your mom. I'm not here. <laughs> mom, I'm in class right now. What are you calling about? Um. Oh, you're in class. Well. Okay. Um. I just want to see where you were. Yeah, I'm at school. Where, where else would I be? Um, I don't know, because I thought you came home. We, I saw you walk in the house, and I thought we were both at home last night. And then I went to your room to see what you wanted for breakfast, and you weren't there, so... Yeah, I left early. Okay. All right. So you're... you're what class are you in right now? Gertie would know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, <laughs> Biology. <laughs> um, it was it midday. It's uh, probably yeah. It's it's like a couple hours. Uh, it's like two um, classroom periods before lunch. Frankie actually does yell out biology though. Oh, is Frankie there? Well, you tell. Roll brains. <laughs> <laughs> Jam this! <laughs> Roll brains to what? To see if you heard, Frankie. See if I heard. Yeah, that's what we have to do. See if you have to do it too. Um, yeah, sure. Um, she didn't hear it. <laughs> I rolled red to get a, a volume. That's a 15 to beat. Okay, I never shit. Never mind. Okay, she didn't hear you. We're going to leave it at that. Um, oh, I was so scared mom uh, would have heard me. Okay. Should I, um, are you trying... Wait, are you the player trying to be heard? Um, I, I, the player, am, am trying to wreak advocacy. Of course you are. Um, mom? Uh-huh? Yeah, I'm in class. All right. Yep. Uh-huh? Um... The teacher's looking at me. The teacher's looking at okay, you? Okay, bye. Wait, 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 What? Can I speak to your teacher? Um, sure. Dad. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. Bad idea. Hold on. Hold on. What? 
You have to pretend to be my teacher. Oh shoot! Um, <laughs> wait, um, what is your teacher? Is your teacher low voice, high voice? What's your? What's your... It's it's Mister. It's Mister. <laughs> Loudon. <laughs> Make Declan do it. She'll recognize Dad's voice. No, wait, no, 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 no. no. <laughs> Declan, step up. Declan. Oh, no, Sorry, Declan. Mom, I'm, going through, I'm going up to class. Everyone's staring at me. Thanks a lot, Mom. I feel really embarrassed. Oh, yeah, I'm oh. sure. Who's the weird girl? I'm just... I, you, uh, are we, is it going to be me? Get, me or Declan? Get ready. Get Which ready, one of us? Get ready. Your sh- 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 okay, all right. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> I... I don't know why your daughter has her phone out in class. It's really strange, uh, kind of unorthodox. I don't think that I will be giving it back for the rest of the period. I'm really sorry we can't talk. I need to teach the class for the rest of the period. Goodbye. <laughs> Holy Damn. shit. I've never heard you like Are that. You actor? Is this Are just you like a choice? Actor? If you're not, you should be. Did you pass this on to us out of shit? I just, like, it just, no. it just, I was just freaked out. It just came out Dad. of me. I don't know. That's I just amazing. assumed it was permanent. I'm going to be honest, kind of hurt my throat. <laughs> <laughs> Declan, go make him some tea with your fancy honey. Declan gets like right up. Right? Declan's like jaws dropped and he's like... <laughs> And like <laughs> takes a, oh, and then like and, and goes to make some some tea. Dad, I have never been more impressed with you right now. Does this mean someday we could talk like that? Um, Wait, let's try it right now. Do do it. Do it. I'm Frankie. Okay, Fox. no, you can't That's do it. Horrifying. Yet. You can't do it yet. That's, That's okay. Scary. You try. You try. Uh, 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 well, no, I can't do it yet. Hey, hang on, hang on. Let me try again. Let me try again. Um, no, it's bad. Wait, no, it's wait, I'm let, waiting. I'm let waiting. Let me I'm get waiting. a few words into it. You need to like yeah, find it a little bit. Sorry. You gotta like practice. <gasps> I'm Frankie Fox. Damn, I lost entirely. All right, wait. Um, so I just like I just like lied to your mom. Yeah, you did. Cause oh. she thinks I'm at school. Oh, sorry, my phone's vibrating. If she ever finds out, you're in for a divorce. <laughs> Hold on. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. Oh my god. Uh, I, I want you to know. No, no, I heard it. I think it's ad funny, but I just recovered from dying. Oh, stop being funny. Can we go back to just being dark and sad? I, I didn't cry as much when we were dark and sad. I still cried. But this is... I didn't uh, choke on my own tears. Jesus. You're in for a divorce. You're in for a divorce. I just assumed I, the, 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 the accent is what binds us all together. Holy shit. And now that you've broken it, this family will fall apart. Christ. Dad, answer the phone. I'm going to get suspicious. How do you know it's mom calling? Who oh, else stop metagaming? <laughs> <laughs> oh God! I love I'm playing lame. a fire genasi warlock. Who talks like this? <laughs> oh shit! What? What? Is that? Is that? I felt possessed. Hang on, let me do it again. I'm Frankie Fox. You can't think about it. Ah! You can't think about it. <laughs> need to, you need to hold on for a second. Oh my god. Oh. Alright, cut. We killed okay. William. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> my throat. Oh man. Oh Jesus. Oh. Um, what do we what do we do while we wait for people to call us back? Hold on. Okay. Hold on. Well you don't have to be involved in this. I got a phone call. <laughs> oh yeah. All right. Okay. Do the voice. <laughs> no. No, it would be so bad. Flying Gertie's teacher. Okay. <laughs> okay. Oh, God. Okay. All right. All right. All right. <laughs> this episode's title: William loses their shit. Okay. Okay. We all right. done love. <laughs> uh, so Marcus like. Pulls the phone out of his pocket and looks at it. And just like goes, It's your mom. Wait, wait, wait. Let me answer. I no. <laughs> uh, don't worry. I got this. 
Hey, hey, Shaxi. <laughs> um, so I called in to to let them know that Gertie was sick home from school because I was trying to, like, figure out where she was. <clears throat> oh, yeah, that's a good idea. Um, wait, no, but she went to school, didn't she? Well, you see, no, here's the thing. I, I thought that she hadn't, but I guess she did. And she pulled her phone out in the middle of class because I called her. I don't know why it was even on. Oh, uh, well, she probably just wasn't paying attention. Um, you know how she gets sometimes. Just, just really bash her. Just make her. <laughs> you know, uh, you know, she kind of like, she figures, she, I, honestly, I think she figured, forgets she has that phone like half the time. Now call her stupid. No. What was that? Oh, Fra Frankie just told me to call her stupid, and I'm not going to do that. <clears throat> oh, yeah, okay. Are you two taking the day off as well? Because I'm kind of thinking I'm taking the day off. Oh, yeah, I'm taking the day off, and uh, I actually, I called in sick from work. Asked her if she <laughs> wants to play D&D. &D. Yeah, do you want to? Um, uh, yeah, what's up? What? Hi. Uh, <coughs> no, so, yeah, so Gertie's at school. Yeah. Gertie's at school, I guess. Are you? Are where are you, Frankie? Where are you at? Oh, we're well. We we're dead. I panicked. And Marcus just hangs up. <laughs> oh, so did I. I'm sorry. You can't just hang up on mom. She's gonna call you right back. Uh, oh my God, she's calling me. I'm gonna. <laughs> <laughs> Hang on. Here, oh, she no, at the okay, school. Okay. Where no, 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 no. It's me. It's me. It's me. Hang on. Daryl will take it. It's me. <laughs> it's, if it's mom. No, it's mom. So I have to answer it as the teacher. Because the teacher took your phone. Oh, wow. Wait, no. No one should answer this. <laughs> <laughs> out the window. Marcus, Marcus throws it out the window of the tree. No! Oh, my God. And it, oh my God. And it hits ground. the window of the... Uh, oh, my God. It hits the window of the <laughs> Rose house. It's true. Dan was a draft guy. Wait, so wait. Keep those roll, someone roll fight to see if it breaks the window. I think I Marcus should roll brawn to see how hard they Oh, good. One. Oh. <laughs> That's, that's how hard it doesn't I reach the window. Yeah. <laughs> the, which window? The, it doesn't oh, matter. Yeah. It just goes. Oh. It, doesn't it, just it just falls out the treehouse and just like hits the ground. Dad. I'm sorry. I, I don't know. I don't know. Wait, you're. Wait, uh, I don't know. What if Declan's parents and Declan's like fainted at this? Yeah. Declan had, like Declan had rounded the, the corner with the tea and is just like pouring it on the, the floor of the treehouse. On his nice tiger skin. It's faux. <laughs> it's photo. It's nice photo. It's photo nice. Dad, it is photo nice. What if, what if the roses saw that? I don't know. Um, all right. Oh, wait. Hold on. Mate. Let's all look to see if they did. <laughs> all right. All at the same time. Um, and they're looking directly at. Them. <laughs> yeah, they're, they're all. They're. they're <laughs> It's it's not them, but Mark it's is. Mark, them. yes, ah, yes. He, he sees all of you, and he and he just waves. Who is that guy? Um, I don't know. De Declan, I think, I think that someone is invading. Them. <laughs> and and Declan no. stops pouring the tea. We need to kill him. No, uh, but the and Declan will come around and see Mark. And when Declan comes around, Mark is like, oh, <laughs> I'm like, uh. And, and I was like, oh, duh, uh, oh, and like ducks down <clears throat> below the window. That was Mark. That was Mark. And no, Mark, no, Mark is living with us. Well, Gertie, you know that. I, I know. Yeah. Bar Bark is uh, just somebody who we're renting my room out to because I spent so much time up at the treehouse. Sometimes tree house, he dresses up as a clam. <laughs> Watch yeah, the I've streets heard. at night. Well, let's invite Mark up. We could use a fourth player. <laughs> you want to invite Mark up to play D&D? &D yeah, we need a cleric. I'm going to go get my phone. Okay, um, I'll go down to talk to Bark. I guess. Are your parents still home? No, 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 no. They went to they went to work. Oh, okay. <clears throat> so Declan slides down the pole. <laughs> and when he's down there, he, he looks at your phone. <clears throat> oh. Three missed calls from mom, and now it's ringing again. I'm surprised it didn't shatter. I mean, it's soft ground, I it's guess. Crazy. It's a bunch of grass. Do I answer it? Do I answer it? Don't okay. answer the phone. What if she keeps calling? Call <clears throat> is she calling you, Dad? Um, oh, well, shoot, now she is. Uh, I'm sorry. <laughs> Stop saying it. <laughs> I'll tell you what. Um, hello, dear. This is your loving <laughs> husband. <clears throat> what is going on? <laughs> 
I had a suspicion, so I decided to call Gertie a few times again. I'm probably just disrupting the class at this point. Hopefully they put the phone on silent. Um, where are you and Frankie? Uh, well, you, you heard Frankie say that we were dead. We are not, in fact, dead. Um, I was just, um, I was driving, so I had, I had to hang up the phone because I realized that's bad to drive while you're, you're on the phone. <sighs> all right, okay, okay. So, um, are you and Frankie just going to be out all day? Uh, at least for a while, yes. Yeah, we're going to be, we're, we're, we blew up some go -Gurt. <clears throat> Tell him about the sound it made. Do the, do the pluck. You blow up. You blow up some gogurt. Yeah, we blew up some gogurt in front of the Rose House. <laughs> uh, it was pretty sweet. We should probably tell them later that it do wasn't actually do like the sound. Oh yeah, the sound was like. It was a little more like. <clears throat> yeah, it was like. <clears throat> and there was a lot of like. <clears throat> Did you get all that? <laughs> <laughs> so what are you two doing now? We're waiting for Phoebe to call us back if uh, she hasn't, but... We're um, not just waiting for Phoebe okay, to call us okay. back. Uh, um, well, we gotta plug in your phone. It's done. Make sure that's done. Cool. It's been done. Over. Uh, yeah, I think... Um, damn it, I'm slipping into... You guys have been doing too much Southern. <laughs> My normal voice is going Southern. Um, <laughs> try Boston. No. Uh, as... Uh, uh, Teddy's coming back down the stairs. He hasn't told Derry any of what happened last night. I, I, I mean, mm -hmm. right? I would assume. So uh, I think that is weighing on him a little bit. And I think he gets to the bottom of the stairs and he's... Derry, I, I lied to my dads again. Like Just about, now. Like about like the shadow place? I mean, like... Is it, is it really... Can we only tell the foxes about this? Uh, I, I, I still don't. I trust your dads. I think I think if there are parents that we can trust with this sort of thing, your dads are them. I don't know that it's good to bring more people into it. And even if I did think it's good, we promised Gertie we were going to keep it between the people that knew. Derry, okay. So, you know how I need your help doing something? Mm -hmm. um, I, didn't, I didn't really sleep last night. We talked about that. I didn't either. Uh, because I was at the <clears throat> graveyard uh, digging up Andy's body. Oh. And it wasn't there. And Phoebe Fox helped me. And then <coughs> we got... I'm looking around to make sure my dads are not in the room. <clears throat> yep. And then we got... She had to go, and then Officer Tallwell showed up, and then she brought me back here, and then I talked to my dads, and I feel like I feel like bad about not telling them. Like, yeah, I mean, I went off and dug up my sister last night. Like, I, I, I think there's a reason that I did that. I, I. I can't not rely on people anymore. I can't. Yeah. I need you guys in yeah. my life. No, Teddy, we're not. We're not going anywhere. I need my dads. I don't know. I can keep lying to them. I hear you. Um. I think if you need to tell them, you need to tell them, but you should let Gertie know first. Because we did make a promise. Okay. And as someone who is like kept secrets from you guys it doesn't feel good that that feels maybe even worse that's fair than keeping secrets from your dad your phone rings my it's, phone yeah the the landline, the landline. Oh, okay <laughs> um do you want to anything else you want to talk about cool. i'll i'll wait cool can i give you a hug yeah cool and Daryl will hug teddy and then answer the phone all right. Okay. So um, I got I got off the phone with Gertie, but you can't call her because she's at school and she got her phone taken away. Um, I'm gonna relay that so they didn't know what she was gonna say. That wasn't on speaker. Um, so just, yeah, she she um, Gertie's at school. Oh, she's and got her phone school? taken away. Oh. So I guess that answers that. Yeah. Well, I guess we gotta go to school then. 
Yeah. I guess, I mean, we were going we there anyway. anyway. Yeah. Can we, should we do band practice first? Are you sure you still want to? I mean, I could. I, I kind of always want to. But I'm worried it might take us the rest of the day. Why don't we do one more, one more private session before we open it up to the general public? I feel like, yeah. you know, like a really, like a sort of, you know, like prep session. Let's do a prep Just really run. iron out yeah. all of the stuff. Maybe we can publish it to, like, the internet first. And sort of gauge, get some feedback. And then I've heard people on the We can talk about nice. it. We can talk about it. There are, th- um, there are things we can do. Yeah. Maybe, yeah. Oh, oh, Phoebe, sorry. Um, yep, still um, here. Sorry. Um, <laughs> yep, 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 yep. Yeah, I think we're going to go to school, too. Um, <laughs> Gary's feeling better. I, yeah. Uh, okay. Um, do you want me to, anything you want me to say to Gertie or? No, it's okay. I think, I think Gertie and I just need to, I don't know. We need okay. to talk. Cool. Um, also, I think we probably should all talk since you kind of know the whole thing about my super secret surprise party. Right. Yeah. yeah. Um, no, we should we should all get so together. Is that happening? Or? Gonna, I don't know. Okay. Um, um, okay. Okay, bye. Bye, I Phoebe. Guess. Bye, Phoebe. Oh. Teddy said bye. Oh, okay, bye. Wait, wait. Bye, Phoebe. All right, thank you. Okay. Thank you, bye. bye. Um, let's go to school. Let's go to school. We go to school. To school! <clears throat> Ed, um... Uh, are you listening, Mark? Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, I'm listening. Okay, so, um, that's how you roll your stats. Now, please, just roll, roll 4d6 and drop the lowest number. I could be Mark, too, I guess. Yeah, so, like... I got an 11. It's a 6 and a 5. Oh, 4. Hang on. Are we sure, no, his, are we sure his name's not Denny? Oh, wait, oh, wait, oh, wait, oh, wait, oh, wait, oh, wait, oh, wait. Shut your mouth. Declan. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Oh, wait, okay. I just, like, I just want I just want this to be a good time. I want everyone to have a good time. You. Um. I think we are having a good time except you, Declan. <laughs> okay, no, that's a good point. That, yeah, I sometimes well, I we take don't, this we don't too have to, We don't have to play D&D today if you don't want to. I mean, I really do want to. Then let's do it. Okay. No. What if we played a different tabletop role-playing game? Perhaps one that's a little more slice of life. I don't know. Or just straight fucking apocalyptic. There, there is one that came out recently <laughs> that oh seems kind of fun. But no, let's go with Dean. It's called Boy Problems. <laughs> <laughs> um, I've been hearing a lot about this thing called Youths on Skateboards. I've never heard of that. and But it sounds fun. Maybe we'll look at it later. Mm-hmm. Um, it, it's by uh, Predators Entertainment. <laughs> you know, like Hunter's Entertainment? Yeah, I get Thank it. Thank you to Hunter's Entertainment. <laughs> Uh, okay. Um, yeah. Let's just. Uh, you know what? Let, we'll, uh, we'll just. I'll, we'll do a tally system. You don't have to roll your shri- your stats. We'll do a tally system. But we can do it. We go like that, and then we can get started playing. Okay. I think that would be cool. That would be a good way to go. Let's do it. Where are we? Goodbye, treehouse. <laughs> no. Where are we in the game? Oh. Okay. <clears throat> so you wake Wait, up. Wait. Let's up. introduce ourselves. So go ahead. Okay. Um. You want to go first, Frankie? Right? Yeah, I'm Frankie Fox, the Fire Genasi Warlock. <laughs> okay. You next, Dad. Um, all right, so I am Buddy the Elf. <laughs> <laughs> from Elf. Uh, from Elf. Um, I, I, guess, I guess I'm really tall, um, which is pretty cool. Wait a minute, shoot, I should have been a human, shouldn't I? I need to remake my character sheet. Man. Hold on. He, no, he, he pulls the marker off. Oh, and starts racing. I gotta be human. I forgot. Buddy Buddy the Elf's moniker is Elf. But species is human. And that's really a rookie mistake on my part. Really quick. William in a home D&D game plays a, an elf named Human Human. And that's this true. is just all crossed and That's true. Up. I forgot about Continue that. with this wonderful story we're telling now. <laughs> um, someone else go. Someone else go. Uh, um. yeah, um... <laughs> Who does Mark play? Um, I'm Mark, and... What is Mark's alter ego? I'm playing, uh, I'm playing a Luxodon, a cleric, 
cleric, right? We needed a cleric. Yeah. Okay, I'm playing a Luxit on cleric. Uh, do am I supposed to pick a name? My name is Tito, Tito, like from Rocket Power. I'm a little young for that show, but I taught you that. <laughs> All right, okay, I got it. Okay, I'm a human. I'm Buddy the Elf, the human. Buddy the Elf, the human. All Buddy right. the Elf, the human fighter. Um, I'm I'm Gertie the Fox. <laughs> Wait, are you playing a fox? We can play animals. Wait, what's a loxodon? Oh, it's like an elephant person. Oh shoot! I could be an ant. Wait, can I be an uh, an anteater? <laughs> no, that was just a flub on my part, Dad. Oh. oh. Wait, I just erased it. I'm I Gertie, gotta rewrite I'm it. I'm Gertie Fox, playing a halfling, and my name is Brick. Like Rick. Lynn. Brickland? Brickland. Brickland. Like Brooklyn, but with a brick. Or like Declan, but with a brick. brick. Yeah. Wait, I want to change it. Franklin, if Frankie Fox is an actual Firefox. Wait, yeah, that seems appropriate. You want to be a web browser? What? No, like a fox that is quite <laughs> literally on fire, but it's not harmed by the fire because it is so produced by the Firefox itself. from Pokemon. Yeah, I want to be Nine Tails from Pokemon. Do okay, uh, uh, okay, uh, but yes, yes, and ah, Declan, <laughs> he's an improviser. What? He started the club at school. Didn't you, you have know? such loser hobbies. No, he does. <laughs> Holy shit! Oh, what, are you, oh, <laughs> what are you two doing now? Oh, We're dang. walking. The, I think. Uh, are we at school? You arrive at school. school? It's it's like lunchtime now. Cool. Oh, cool. So we know where to find Gertie. Lunchroom. Mm-hmm. <laughs> We go to the lunchroom to find Kurt. Mm-hmm. Fox. Um, roll brains, both of you. <laughs> <laughs> you first. Five. One. She's dead. On a 20. Damn. That's not good. That's real bad. Actually, it's pretty One in bad. five? Pretty bad, yeah. Yeah, six total. Um. Yeah, you... How do I... Did you say six total? Yeah, you know, for, oh, for like the, a unit. Oh, of you combined. <laughs> Um, all right. If this is too far, let me know. But I think you forget what you were doing. Yeah, I I think, uh, well, here's the thing. I haven't said that Derry's eaten today. Oh, yeah. So uh, he's probably hungry. hungry. Get distracted by so I think it's a good like, thing we're at lunch. Mm-hmm. So I'm going to get in the lunch line. But you don't see Gertie. Uh, also, you can mark adversity. Cool. Derry, we got to find Gertie. Yeah, one second. No, but. Hold on. They kept the wrong pizza. And it's they have the vegan today? option today, which means, though I am not vegan, I can eat it because I'm lactose intolerant, and I gotta have my pizza. <laughs> that, okay. Okay. Thank Dar- you. Teddy gets in line with him. <laughs> okay, and then, um, yeah, Gertie. Um, Gertie. 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 I'm sure she's here. Huh. Yeah, she's eat, around. You should eat something, Derry. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, you ever think it's funny that your name is Derry, but you're lactose intolerant? It's spelled differently, so no. And then you get through the door, and there's a barrel, a barrel, and a barrel on the floor in front of you, and there's nothing else in the room. What do you do? Can I roll investigation? Yeah, you can roll investigation. <laughs> well, she does that. I'm going to tip over the third barrel. You're going to tip over the third barrel? I got 17. 17? Oh, okay. All right, 17 for investigation, and you're tipping over the third barrel. Okay, well, before you get to the third barrel to tip it over, because you got a 17. All right, with a 17, <clears throat> you, you see right before that there are, there are, there are like, Trigger, uh, uh, there are triggers on the bottom of each barrel, and if you touch them, they're actually dynamite and they'll explode. I'm gonna use slide of hand, I have plus two to my dexterity. <laughs> That's 21. 21. <laughs> oh. Okay, all right, all right. So, you, you, uh, yeah, you definitely, you can. I'm not like, even proficient. Wow, you're not even proficient. That's a big I got tiny fox paws. Wow, lucky. Um, <laughs> yeah, can I, um, I'm gonna, can I drink what that whatever's inside the barrel? <laughs> I'm sorry, what? <laughs> yeah, it's barrels, so it's like it's like a keg, right? 
It's like a keg. Oh so can I drink what's inside of it? Uh, I, 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 I just said it was Dynavite. It's Dynavite. Huh? Oh. Um, is that like is that a type of beer in this world or something? Uh, but Mark, it's Dynavite. It's like you like like explodes, <laughs> like it explodes. Like you, if it gets ignited or on fire. I am quite literally on fire. All right. Um. So so no, I can't drink it. But but uh, Mark, are, do you want to be here? Because I want to make sure everybody wants to be here. Oh yeah, no, I'm having a great time. You just defuse like a bomb or something, right? That's like that movie, The Hurt Locker. That's pretty sweet. <laughs> Anybody see that one on Oscar? Yeah, it's pretty good. Uh... <laughs> I think it's Dad's turn. Mark, Mark, was that your was that your turn? Oh, are we an initiative? I didn't realize. <laughs> No, we're not an initiative. We're not a <laughs> um, okay. um, So we're just sitting down. I have eaten three pieces of vegan pepperoni pizza. Um, and I've gone back for a fourth. And I set it down on the table. I can't eat this. Are you hungry? I, Derry, I'm not even done with my piece yet. Okay, I'm going to try to eat this. If I pass out, will you drag me by my scruff to the nurse's office? Yeah, I mean, shouldn't we tell somebody we're at school first? Mm -hmm. Before I drag you unconscious into the nurse's office? That's a good next step. Yeah. Because my parents would have called in. Mm -hmm. So they, the school thinks we're not here. The That's school true. thinks we're can, not here. Can both of you roll brains again? Yeah. The school thinks we're not here, Teddy. <laughs> Hell yeah. Uh, 16. 7. That's it. <laughs> Seven, that's it? Okay, cool, cool, cool. Um, so, I mean, like, with a seven, you... A lot get, of pepperoni. Excuse you, Derry. So sorry. With a seven, I would say you see... You see students, um, like, shorter, less conspicuous students who generally, like, fly under the radar going and, like bringing, like, bags of stuff to, to people at, like, tables and then collecting money from them and, like, walking away. And, like, there's, like, quite a few of them. Uh, and you've never seen this before. Like, but with a 16, mm -hmm. you, you see that happening and, like, you follow them and, like, you see off kind of, like, in the corner of the cafeteria where everybody is bringing, like, money to... Uh, Izawa Yuri, who is um, a Japanese student, a Japanese American student who had you have never heard speak. Okay. And is like, and has really been like unimposing. But like, he has, I mean, like, picture like a j-pop mm -hmm. yeah person like a, 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 an artist and like this is like just very like waved like dark brown like kind of blackish hair off to the side a very very like soft features kind cool. of person um but dressed like impeccably mm -hmm. and he's just like chilling there and people so so there are Smaller students collecting money from people and bringing them to his table. Gary, is basically what I see. Gary, yeah. is that kid selling drugs? No, I I think while we were gone, Isawa became a king. Is he a kingpin? Like Marvel's the kingpin? Um, Daredevil. Marvel's the Daredevil. Hey, this is either something we need to stop or get in on. You want to go talk to him with me? No, not really. Okay. I mean, no, we no, can't, but to. no, but we, I mean, we're looking for Gertie, right? Gertie! Gertie. All right, Mark, I really think you need to just, you just, like, sit out. I, there's no reason to get this uh, upset. I, I mean, like, we can call the situation. All right, uh, I, okay, I, I promise I'll sit back down. But I just, I mean, like, I don't understand why I, my character exploded when everybody else is dead. <laughs> <laughs> well, everybody got out of the room, and then you said, and you said this, I want to go pick up the middle barrel and drink 
And I told you over and over again that we had already figured out they were dynamite. Well, yeah, but like, but you could have been lying. No, but you rolled good. You, I won't. I'm not gonna like try and fool you unless like. I mean, it's not. We're we're, we're it's like collaborative. We're playing back. I mean, uh, and he like looks at her and he's like, I really. I think we might need to postpone. I that's, think we. That's fine. I mean, like yeah. I yeah, postpone more like never play again because my character is dead. So. Well, Mark, or maybe we just won't ever play with you again. Ooh. Yeah. Whatever. Okay. Well, what, yeah, but what, do we level up? Uh. Yeah, next time we play you, you'll be, you'll be a level two. Cool. Cool. You'll be a level three. Wait a minute. All right. So let me get this straight. That wasn't beer. <laughs> <laughs> it was dynamite. Um, yeah, Dad. I knew it. <laughs> I knew it. I'm glad I got out of that room. Dad. Oh, that's right. Luxodon lives again. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, is he a Luxodon? He's a Luxodon. Yeah, he's a Luxodon. Yeah, he's he's a buddy the, the Luxodon. The Luxodon. I'm buddy the Luxodon. I switched it because I wanted to be an animal. Well, um, maybe you and Dad should go home. They want to make out. Let's go home. No, oh, crazy. Shoot. Wait, no. Or oh, and uh, Declan's like beet red. <laughs> <laughs> it's like different shades of red. And uh, um, no, 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 no. Uh, oh, do you want them to stay? No. Yes. No. <laughs> I mean, no. I don't. I if they left, it would. It would. I wouldn't want them to leave because we were gonna make out. I would. I would want them to leave because. because <laughs> Um, Declan, Declan was just gonna show me one of his horror movies that... Yeah, it, we're watching... It's a horror movie marathon. Yeah. Yes. Yes. Um, Frankie, will you please take Baby home? Make sure she's okay. She had quite a night last night as well. Bark twice you're gonna totally kiss. Baby so barks twice. <laughs> <laughs> For shits and gigs, I'm gonna roll... Okay, sure, sure, sure. <clears throat> Fifteen. Fifteen, roll 2d4. That's going to be four, five, six, seven. Seven? Um, yeah, BB barks twice, and then you all hear a clink in one of the dice trays, and you look over, and BB has rolled a natural 20. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we have the luckiest... T oh, did Declan know? Um... She is magic. Is Mark still in the room? No, Mark left. Yeah, okay, cool, cool, cool. <laughs> I thought the same thing. I was like, Declan, I'm worried about Mark. Frankie, <clears throat> can you do it again? My magic dog is not a play thing for you. <laughs> Mark asked me want to do it again. <laughs> it's going to be a two. Pull 2d4. That's going to be... Wait, is that two with your plus? Uh, oh, it was Cause not. Because you, you love dogs. Um, but hang on, that was 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11? Because if we're adding that plus 2 loves dogs? Well, that, that goes to the, the d20 roll, right? So then it would be 4 and 11. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. So tell us what happens to Mark. <laughs> Next time on Hijinks and Handlebars. No. Oh, no. Wait, but you pointed oh, no. at all of us, so you're gonna do something. <laughs> we will think we will we will we will find out what BB is but, about to do. <laughs> but, but you you pointed this and rolled a d4, and then you said next time, and now I want to know. Yeah, I know. William! I'm going to hint which power did she use, William. No. Well, she didn't use the one that Frankie is in charge of. <laughs> so no lasers. <laughs> so no lasers. No lasers. <laughs> Thank you, cool. William, for watching. Yeah, thanks, everybody, for watching another episode of Hijinks and Handlebars. Um, I cannot 
fucking believe that we did yeah. not get through Halloween today. <laughs> not shit. for another month. At oh my least. god. Look, it's taken us What's like happening? what four episodes to get two days, so we at least oh got shit. another two or three episodes. It's, listen, I love it and it's incredible, and I love being here with you guys. And, and I love all like of you, tried. and I love yeah. everyone who's watching. You're all great, and I love this game. Thanks, Hunters Entertainment. Oh. Thank you, Q Times. And if you want to be but in our special shit. episode where we play D and D in character. <laughs> Okay, so, um, yeah, thank you uh, so much for watching. If you're watching live, I can't wait to see what you said in the chat. Thank you for that. Uh, if you're watching the VODs the videos on demand on Q Times' main YouTube channel, then awesome, thank you for that. Leave a comment. I, I go back and, like, I try to read as many as I can, and Q Times, like, lets me know when they, when they uh, get comments. So I will see those as well. Um, <clears throat> share this with your friends. Uh, share, like, some stuff. I actually had, so, uh, Izawa Yuri is a character created by Austin. <laughs> oh, yes! Yeah, yeah. Our first one! A viewer of the show. Yeah, so, thank, yeah, you, thank Austin. you, Austin. So thank you, Austin. Thank you. Uh, Austin doesn't get to watch live, but Austin does watch every single VOD, so... Fuck yeah. I thought they Shut sounded up. familiar when you were describing him. Yeah. But, yeah. Um, yeah, so that's, like, the first time we've done something like that. Uh, if you feel so inclined, if you create a character... Um, and like even like a little bit of backstory, they can be as like embedded into the world as you want. Um, and you you go through the character creation process of assigning like stats and getting the strengths for them and like that kind of thing, letting me know if they're a kid, a teen, or an adult. Uh, everything that goes into creating a kids on bikes character, and you send me that character sheet or at least the information. And you can either do that like on Twitter or on Instagram. Um, I think those are the two best ways to get a hold of me, and that's at k william white. You can either send it to me personally, which that would be the best way because I am the GM and I, I will see it. Hey, tag all of us though. I want to see that shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But if you send me that, um, and I think it could be something I could incorporate into the story, then I will use your character. Yeah. Fuck yeah. Thank and you, Austin. That's so you. cool. Yeah. Thank, and thanks for watching. You've created a king. Quick tag along. Um, if you go on the at handle stream Instagram, um, there are a few posts which can kind of help walk you through the character creation process if you're so curious. So if you don't even want to worry about the mechanics, like just the description will be enough to like yeah. get there. Yeah, if you give me enough of a description, I can like even assign the dice or like whatever. So um, that would be cool. Uh, that's an option that we have as of right now. Unless we blow up and get a bunch of submissions for now, like I can handle any- twenty four thousand. Y'all, we, we we were talking about subscriber growth in this episode, and and it's a real thing. It's a real problem that a lot of small streams have. Is it's a like, real problem. You know, subscriber growth. You just subscribe grow too fast. What too, do you do? Too fast. What well, then? You know. <laughs> then when do you stop? You know. It's when do you then, stop growing? Yeah. Great. Um, so, what are the usual things we do at the end of the Anyways, here? I've been just. Uh, yeah, just, yeah. Well, thank you again yeah. to Hunters Entertainment, which we thanked a bunch. Thank you, Tanamato. Thank you, Austin. Thank you, Q Times. Thank you, Indigo. Thank you, Krug. Thank you, my cast. Thank you, viewers. Um, so, yeah, seriously, please tell people about this show because, like, we've uh, this is our 13th episode. 15 if you count the zero session and uh, 12.5 that we just did oh, last week. Fuck. Last week's episode is so if good. If you want to get anybody into this show, I think 12.5 is a good place to start um, yeah. if yeah. they want to see like actual active gameplay. I mean, I would say start at episode one mm -hmm. um, because Franny's in it. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and Franny's the main cast, like in the main cast. But uh, we had she we had is. we had Tanimato, um Chris Noguchi on last week, and it was a really great time. It's kind of a one-off. Mm -hmm. uh, like if you know the characters, you get a little bit more out of the episode, but you don't have to know them in order to. Like yeah. really, and there's like, a lot of new characters too. So like, it's, yeah. Why was Dake Marin? Why did Dake Marin give off that weird noise when that thing happened? Or you'll be like Baldwin Baldman. What kind of stupid? And then it comes up in stream. <laughs> <laughs> Great. Um. So yeah, twelve point five is a good start point if you just want someone to get involved in um like the activity of the gameplay. Uh, uh episode one is a good place to start if you want to just like catch up episode like session zero is a good place if you want to be like really informed on all the characters and like where we came from and what we were doing and uh uh that'd be awesome share it please tweet please. and like and tweet about the show please. please please like tweet a quote from the show tweet like Anything. your favorite line tweet something and and at handle stream but please. don't add it at the beginning because if you add it at the if you just say at handle stream and that's the first thing you type only handle stream uh, and their followers will see, will see that. So so put it at the end. So if you want to add it, just do a period at handle stream, and that will circumvent that, that those circumstances. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Okay.
That's all. That's all. Watch the rest of Q Times shows. <laughs> there, there, all... There's something tomorrow. It's Apocalypse World. Spencer is is Y'all, GMing it. It's fucking great. It's gonna be adult content, but Spencer can talk about it a little bit more when we do our outros, which we're gonna do right now. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. I have been William. I uh, and I have been the GM for Hijinks and Handlebars. You can find me on Twitter and Instagram at K William White. I have been Jonas Newhouse playing Derry Nazari. Uh, you can find me on Twitter at Jonas Newhouse. Uh, you can also find me, uh, yeah, at Jonas Newhouse uh, every uh, Tuesday here and most Wednesdays, including tomorrow for Spencer's game that uh, he will tell you about. And next Wednesday, I will be running uh, Jason Statham's <laughs> Big Vacation <laughs> with a twist. Um, I imagine we'll post about it more as Q times tomorrow, so follow them as well. Uh, that's all I got. I've been Sam Richardson playing Teddy Tedward Tank Thompson. You can find me on Twitter at L A G G A R D S O N. See, I make up for it on the end. Thank you. I almost am not ready for it. <laughs> uh, I will always be Franny. Uh, you can find me on the Instagram at J U S T underscore F R A N N I E. I would say you could find me, but my phone's hella dead, so I'm not on any social media. But you can usually find me at Splubble on Instagram. It's like Bubble, but with a spla. Um, quick blurb about tomorrow's Apocalypse World. Um, we'll have some very lovely people on there. Um, Apocalypse World is a great game if you love swearing. Um, I think there's not a single page. We know you do. There's not a single page that doesn't have the F-bomb on it, I'm pretty sure. I was looking through at least twice in the first page. Page. It's great. Um, lots of sex and violence, most likely, um, but we'll be finding out more as we come. Tomorrow night, 6.30 p.m. Um, Pacific. Yay. Cool. Check it out. And if you're watching it on the VOD, it's probably going to be on the Q Times channel, I assume. But yay! Jake and Kareem will be there. It'll be great! Cool. Also, I'm Spencer. Is that everyone? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> great, great. Okay, cool. Thanks so Thanks, much. Thanks, y'all. We'll, we'll see you next Thank week. You. We'll see you next Bye. week. Come back next week, please. It's so good.